You must be tired of these lectures. I know I'm tired of giving them. And now you have to stay here with me all weekend instead of going on the retreat with everyone else? I don't care. Yes, that is the crux of the problem. I don't see why I'm the only one being punished. Because you started the fight. You wouldn't give me back my book. I told you to leave those books in your room. You only have yourself to blame. It doesn't give him the right to just snatch it from me. Does that give you the right to start throwing punches? It wasn't just about the book. What was it then? Nothing. I'll save it for confession. No matter what I try, you seem insistent on going down the same sad road as your brother. What a waste.
See you. Up and around we go. Whoa! Too slippery. and quiet. Uh-oh. Isn't it our job to help boys like him? In the meantime, I'm neglecting the other dozen boys under my care. <sighs> what do you want me to do? You know my opinion. <laughs> I'm not ready to give up on him yet. You can't keep avoiding it. Look, I'll talk to him in the morning, okay? Good night, Father. Good night, Sister Catherine. my file. Get to that window. Sister Catherine? Oh, darn. Oh. Oh, Sister Catherine, I've forgotten my keys again. Can you open the gate for me? Coming, Father. Watch your back. <laughs> All right. Hey, it's good to see you, little brother. What was that? Really? Again? It's nothing. You told me you'd stay out of trouble, though. He was talking shit about us. So? He said that Dad dumped us here because we're worthless, and Mom is in hell because... Nathan, Nathan, come on. They're just saying it because it gets to you. All right? You just gotta learn to laugh it off. You wouldn't. Well, do as I say, not as I do. Here. You'll catch a cold. So, what are you doing here like this anyway? If the nuns catch you, they're gonna call the cops. Well, I got something for you. And I couldn't wait till Christmas. What? 
It's outside. What happened to us staying out of trouble? Uh, this is an exception. Mm-hmm. <laughs> now he's jumping. Come on. Here, give me a hand. Right. The sister's feeding you enough. <sighs> the place is kind of empty. Where is everyone? Some Bible retreat. Yeesh. I remember those. <sighs> How's Father Duffy doing? He's the one decent guy in there. You should come and say hi. Nah. I don't need the guilt. This way. We're getting there. Oh. That was easy. <clears throat> Damn. You didn't prop it. I, I, I did. At least I thought I did. No, it doesn't matter. We're gonna take the high road. The high road? Just follow me. Watch this. Whoa. And now, we take the high road. Have you done this before? Uh, once or twice. Yeah, come on. Your turn. What you been up to? I'm working mostly. You still dating that girl? Oh, uh, Crystal? Uh, on again, off again. Currently off again. Okay. No guts. No glory. Whoa, whoa. Just don't think about it. You got this. I got you. See? No big deal. Yeah. Nothing to it. Stay with me. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Totally. Yeah, through here. Right behind you. There's a jump coming up. Okay. Okay. Right down the middle. Nice and easy. Ah. Oops. Was that a sin? I think that's a sin. You ready, Tarzan? Yeah. All right, go ahead. The steeple. Come on. I can't jump that high. All right, just go around the corner. <sighs> it's a nice view, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Not bad. You ever been up here before? At this particular roof? No. But you do know where you're going, right? More or less. Now you wait here and you watch me. Oh, oh, oh. Your turn. Okay. You got this. You got this, Nate. All right. 
Go ahead. Just don't overthink it. Oh, crap! Oh, God, shit! Come on. Ah. I did it. Yeah, of course you did. Follow me. You know what? How about you take this one? Really? Yeah, really. I'll follow your lead. All right. After you. Now, head down. Just like that, we're out. All right. Check it out. Huh? Whoa, <laughs> you got the 250? 250? What are you talking about? No, this is the 500 cc twin. No way. Yeah. Where'd you lift it from? Whoa. That's a low blow. But hey, I'll have you know that I am a changed man. Bought this with hard earned cash. Here, come on, take a seat. What? The only time you pull a stunt like this is when you're trying to make up for something. You are too smart for your own good, you know that? All right. I got this job. Pays well. Really well. But, uh, I gotta leave town for a little bit. What's a little bit? Uh, like, uh, a year. At the most, and then I'll be back before you even know it, all right? You're bailing on me. Uh, come on, don't be so dramatic. What, so it wasn't bad enough to leave me in that place? How could you do this to me, Sam? Wait, wait, I'm doing this for you. The money I make is for the both of us. And then in a couple of years, a when you're out... years? Take me with you. I, I can barely support myself. I'll pitch in. I know you think the orphanage sucks. You have no idea. Yeah, but it's the best thing for you right now. All right? You just gotta trust me on that one. It's not fair. Hey. Nothing about our lives has been fair. We've made it work, right? Sure. Well, you know, the bike wasn't the only surprise. And I guess I'm gonna have to ruin the next one. What? I found Mom's stuff. Everything that Dad sold, I tracked down the buyer. If you're saying this just to make me feel better... Mm -hmm. I swear to God. Where? Yeah. On the other side of town. What do you say we go and get it back? You mean steal it? Eh, it's not stealing if it was ours to begin with. I'm pretty sure the cops aren't gonna see it that way. Well then let's not get caught. You ready for this? Hell yeah. más fácil de lo que esperaba, eh? We're gonna have to do it better than that, pal. Acabemos con esto. Let's go. Chingada, este gringo sabe pelear, eh? A ver cómo te sales de esta. ¿Qué tal esto? Asshole, let go of me. Gánamelo. Rompele el brazo. Right back at you. Lucha como un hombre. All right. Gracias, Mark. 
Amigo, esto es por matarte con nosotros. Una paliza. Dale una paliza. No, sí, pendejo. Te vas a arrepentir. Puedes hacerlo. Acaba con Shit. Te voy a matar, come mierda. Te voy a cerrar la bocota, gringo. ¿Qué? ¿Qué vas a hacerlo? ¡Ya basta! ¡Vaya! ¡Ya basta, idiota! ¡Suéltame! ¡Hey, we weren't fighting! ¿Eh? Huh? ¿Right, little guy? ¡Te voy a matar! ¡Te digo como mierda! ¡Hey, give me a call when you're tall enough to ride the rides! ¡Te voy a sacar a tirar por el culo! ¡Solitaria! ¡Cállalo! ¡Te voy a estar esperando aquí, eh! Abre. Come on. How long am I supposed to be in here? Huh? Where's the toilet? You looking at it. Have fun. I will. Gracias. Having a great dream too. Hey, hey, hey! All right, easy. Ah. All right, calmate. Yeah. Hey, uh, any chance I can take a shower? Cállate. Morning, boys. Or is it the evening? It's hard to tell down here. Oye, idiota! Get up the stairs. Esos dos tienen toda la suerte. Dejaron a Molina tranquilo una semana. Viene saliendo un prisionero. Abran las rejas. Una semana. Son tipo generoso. Hey, nice to see you. Humid. Ah, welcome to Panama. Hey, gringo. Vi lo que hiciste a Gustavo. Tengo un Estás cuchillo muerto. que tiene tu nombre, amigo. Te lo hey, mostraré Vargas. cuando regreses. Déjanoslo a nosotros. Nos encargamos Atrás. de él. Muévanse. Quítense, cabrones. Hey, hey. Tranquilízate. Looks like you have some fans. Yeah, my adoring public. Abre la reja. ¿A dónde lo llevas? <risa> es una sorpresa. <risa> Diviértete. You speak a little Spanish, you know. <risa> Wait, what, what did you say? You'll find out soon enough. Te lo advertí. No escuchaste. ¿Qué está mirando? Nada, amigo. Atrás. De este me encargo yo. Bien. Where are you taking me anyway? You'll see. Por favor, para, para. No, no, not that way. Oh, all right. To you? Yeah, this isn't sketchy at all. Hey, you know, this doesn't look like the warden's office. Go left. Yeah, I'm on it. Through there. Through here? Alright. 
Take these cuffs off or what? I want in. In? Whatever you hope to find up there, I want in. <laughs> now, come on, Vargas. The deal was just to get us in and out of here. That's it. Just? I'm sticking my neck off for you, gringos. Yeah, and Rafe is paying you a lot of money for your trouble. See? Si. But not nearly enough. You were told not to open that. Yes. I was also told not to take bribes, not to bring anyone here, and not to beat on my inmates. But here we are. Just be careful with that. It's 300 years old. I was a member of Captain Henry Avery's crew. You know who that is? He was a pirate. The pirate who pulled off the biggest heist in history and got away with it. I looked him up. That's great. Over Can 400 we... million dollars worth of gold and jewels, all from one single ship. The, the Gunsway. Yeah. yeah. I'm familiar with the story. Can you get to the point? Uh-huh. I occupied the highest cell in the Spaniard's prison. <laughs> Here. I hope someday you will find your way into this infernal place, bear my cross, and discover the riches of paradise. What? What do you want? The riches of paradise. Oh, it's a metaphor. No, 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 no. You and your friends did not pay to get into this infernal place in search of a metaphor. I want in. Right. I tell you what. Let me go up there, check out the prison cell. If there's still anything there after 300 years, you can take this up with Rafe. Now, come on. Letter. Por favor. How are you gonna get up there anyways? Climb. Oh, unless, of course, you want to do it since you want in and all. Just don't break your neck. That's the plan. Hey, did you bring what I asked? Yeah. Eat it just over there. Under the work table. By the crib. Uh -huh. There we go. Piece of cake. Bingo. Now we're in business. All right, this should do the trick. And there's the prison cell. How do I get up there? Here we go. Slide down there. Look on that post. <laughs> Wait till Sam hears about this. <sighs> Onward and upward. the highest cell. <laughs> These burns had a nice view before he was executed.
Hard to believe there were dozens of pirates holed up in here just waiting to be hanged. Okay, where to? <laughs> Gotta find a way up. Can barely believe this place is still standing. Spanish sure knew how to build a sturdy prison. Wonder how many pirates died here? Not gonna lie, <laughs> this is pretty awesome. <laughs> oh man, Sam is missing out. Here we go. Burns his cell. Cell? More like a suite. Okay. Where to begin? Sun and moon. Alchemy symbols for gold and silver. Wait a sec. I saw something like this on the letter. Huh. Well, that's part of the symbol. Ah. Here's the other half. Now then. That's more like it. Okay, got a zodiac symbol. Sagittarius. And the Scorpio sign. Ten and two. X and II. Digna factis recipimus. <sighs> Guess this is it. Right. Time to head back. Watch that first step. Down we go. Huh. Now. Careful. Time. <laughs> yeah, I see Rafe do that. <laughs> ah, it goes my shoulder. There's Vargas. I want a cut. <laughs> I want in. I'll give you in. <laughs> Now we're talking. You made it. What'd you find? 
Greg? What? The place was picked clean. If there's a clue hidden up there somewhere, I couldn't find it. Are you sure? Were you looking in the right place? Maybe I just I missed something in the letter. There could have been another tower that collapsed centuries ago. Yeah. There are uh, any plans to this place? You know, like blueprints? Uh, could be. There's a bunch of old files. Okay, great, great. Go look through those, okay? See what you can dig up. Meanwhile, I'll, I'll talk to Sam. He's our Avery expert. Maybe he can make sense of this whole mess. Right. I'll, I'll look through the files. Yeah. Turn around. Yeah. Done talking to him, come and find me. You got it. Ah. Gringo, if I catch you fighting one more time, one week in the hole for you. It's a nice acting part. Almost as good as mine. Que puedo decir, eh? Suerte de principiante, ¿verdad? Hijo de puta. Lo siento, chicos. Tengo que irme. Claro, te vas cuando estás ganando. Para ti, ¿eh? Jesus, uh, they worked you over. Good, you all right? Uh, just another day at the office. Come on. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. You're gonna keep me in suspense, are you? You were right. <laughs> no, we were right. No. We just gotta find Rafe. No, and... Rafe. Don't, don't start, please. Oh, come on. Like you said. We did this. You and me. Now this rich asshole comes in on the tail end. How long have we been trying to get in here? <sighs> we had some leads. No, we didn't. Okay, not one. So like it or not, no Rafe, no Vargas, and no getting in here. Speaking of Vargas, we got a problem. What kind of problem? Did he let you into the old prison? Yeah, yeah, he did. Right. After he read the letter. Mm. Hmm. So how much does he know? Enough that he wants a cut. Oh, shit. Rafe, if anybody else finds out about oh, this... I'll work it out with Vargas. Don't sweat it. Right now, let's just... Let's get on to more important matters. All right. Let's find somewhere a little more, uh, private. Yeah. All right, coast is clear. Okay, so, what do we got? Oh, shit. Huh? Hey. May I? Just be careful, okay? Wood with gold and silver inlay. It's well made. <laughs> it's hollow. <laughs> Why would one of Avery's men go through the trouble of hiding a cheap crucifix? It's not a crucifix. Technically, a crucifix is a representation of Jesus. It's not Jesus. Well, you're right. There's no crown of thorns. He's tied to the cross. Well, if it's not Jesus, then... Read the inscription. <sighs> Digna factus recipimus. We receive... We receive... We receive the due rewards of our deeds. Yeah. Look at you. There's a benefit of growing up in a Catholic orphanage. That's St. Dismas. Yeah, a penitent thief. But what's the connection? Guys, let's just pretend I skipped all of Sunday school. <clears throat> okay, uh, during the crucifixion, Jesus is placed between two thieves, okay? One of them mocked Jesus. The other one, this guy, was penitent. Okay? He accepted his punishment with grace. And Jesus brought him to paradise. Penitent thief. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> What? You figured it out? There is a cathedral of St. Dismas in Scotland. Wait, the last sighting of Avery was in Scotland. That can't be a coincidence. No. <laughs> you know, I had my doubts about you, too, but... Let's find Vargas. Get the hell out of the shithole. Oh. <laughs> Let me guess, this is the guy you picked a fight with? Ah, uh, didn't know he had so many friends. Te dije que no habíamos terminado. Mira, ya nos ganaste, okay? 
Muy tarde para hablar. Aquí no sales. Hey, you know what? Tú no te metas. Ok. Did you have to pick on the most popular guy in this joint? Oh, I didn't hear you volunteer. I save it for later. And they will. Eat. What you got, asshole? Siéntate! Come here, you. Good. I'm good for now. Jab, jab, strike. Jab, jab, strike. Where the snow chips? Oh shit! We're not done here, guys. Let's make this quick so we can get out of here. Basta de hablar. Alguien más necesita que le recuerde las reglas. Alíñense. ¿Qué es esto? ¿Eh? Dame. Are you bringing in contraband, Fergus? Cállate. Who do you think you are? Llévalo a su celda. Trae a los gringos a mi oficina. Déjanos. Déjennos. long enough. We almost got killed, you know? You still might. Vargas? Seriously? Oh, I didn't find anything. It must be in a different tower. Well? How can I say? I was raised Catholic. I always carry one. <laughs> Funny. Hey, 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 look. It's worthless, all right? You think I'm an idiot? Okay, you want to renegotiate? Fine, stop acting like a third world thug. Put the gun away. <laughs> Thank you. We're willing to give you a uh, 10%. <laughs> Think half. We're doing most of the work, 20, and you'd never find it without us. 25 equals. Does that sound fair, guys? I suppose I can live with that. Yeah, sure. I mean, 400 million divides nicely by four. Looks like we have a deal. Yes, we have a deal. Oh. And if you ever cross me at <laughs> 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 Jesus. That's that. Are you out of your goddamn mind? Do you want to find out? I'm done. Guys, what are we doing here? We're sticking to the plan. Was this part of the plan? Just follow me. Come on. Come on! 
God damn it. Rafe, where are we going here? The lighthouse. Vargas said the boat is right under the lighthouse. But which way? I don't know. We'll get outside and figure it out. Shit! Get in! Uh, the window! Hurry up! Now? There, it's open! We got it! Then go! Come on! I don't see the lighthouse! Right now, let's just get away from the guard. Down this way! This way. Uh, uh, no, 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 wait. Uh, over here. Come on, come on. Damn it! It's locked. Nice. Shit! Another dead end. Come on, Sam. Ready? Let's go! Yeah, after you. Over the roof, follow me! Are you sure? Yes! Seriously? Up with Ray. Quickly. You thought you trusted him. I do. What point? Uh, he's gonna leave without us, isn't he? Not if we're quick. Come on. After you. Uh, they're everywhere. Okay. Looks clear. Damn it, this place is like a maze. Yeah, it's like they don't want us to leave or something. After this. Oh, oh shit. This Guard! For a while, huh? No! Oh, amigo. Right! Good to see it. Get down that ladder for us. Close. There's the lighthouse. Like I said, stick to the play. I don't celebrate yet. They don't see us this way. That's right. Just keep searching over there. Find us. There it is. Come on! And don't drop the cross. Ah, hell. On me! Get to the wall! Now! Sam! Keep going! Go! No. No, you hold on. Hold on. Sam! Give me your other arm. Arm reach. No! Sam! We gotta move. No, no, he's still down there. No, he's gone. Come on, the boat's just beyond the wall. No. No, I can't. I can't. I can't leave him behind. Nate! Your brother is dead. Either come with me or join him. Have it your way. Sam. Oh, God, no. No. Oh, God. Okay. Okay, gotta get out of here. Sam. I'm coming, I'm coming. I gotta keep coming.
You made it to the bottom. Okay. According to your signal, you're at the coordinates. Can you sign up our hold? No. Not yet, anyway. You got any pinks from up there? Afraid not. All right. I'll just keep heading downstream. Copy that. Keep me posted. You got it. Hey, I might watch you down to a quarter tank. You want to come up? Nah, I'll be fine. Can't be far. If you don't find it soon, I'm calling it. I'll find it. All right. Hey, I got something here. What is it? No rust, right color. Maybe it hit the rocks, tore off before tumbling. Hey, you're mumbling. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, it looks like a piece of our wreck. Must be close by. You're teasing me now, Drake. You're teasing me. Ah, there you are. I found it. All right. How's it look? Uh, it's beat up, but intact. What do we got here? All right, I can see the cargo. It's like most of the crates are here. Can you get an accurate count? I'm gonna have to go inside for that. Stand by. All right, here we go. <laughs> Fellas, all right, I'm in. Uh, looks like a lot of it's still strapped down. Let's see, we got one, two, three, four, five, five. Okay, by my count, we're shy two crates. I'm gonna go round them up. Hold on. How about you come up first, get a fresh tank? Ah, uh, the crate's gotta be nearby. I got this. Ha! <laughs> Found one. Crap. The crate's pinned beneath the trailer. Tell you what, secure the other crate first, then we'll lift the trailer up for you. Uh, you see, that's why you get paid the big bucks. <laughs> yeah. Ha! <laughs> Found the other crate. One down, one to go. Secure it in the trailer. We're nearly at your position. All right, see you soon. <sighs> this thing's getting heavy. Remember, only thing I want to recover from that riverbed is that trailer. All right, that's one crate secure. Good timing. We're right above you, slings on its way down. Try looping it around one of the axes. That should work. Yep. Yeah. Hey, that's one. All right, you watch your oxygen now. That's fine. That's two. Okay, trailer secure, ready to go. All right, get clear, we'll lift it up. Ready when you are. And up we go. Okay, that enough? Yeah, plenty. Just don't drop it on me. <laughs> no promises.
Okay, got the other crate. I'm gonna strap it in with the others. Cargo present and accounted for. Yeah, with five minutes of oxygen to spare. Jesus. Hey, maybe you should hang out then. See if you can find some other treasures down there. <laughs> nah, I'm good. Wanna ride up? <laughs> I'd love one. Let me know when you're on the sling. Okay, I'm in position. Get me out of here, will you? You got it. Going up. Uh -uh. Look at that beauty. How you feeling? Oh, better now that I'm out of that river. Gonna stick like fish for a week. <laughs> All right. We're gonna come to you. Hang on. Hang on. What's up, boys? Good to have you back, Drake. Yeah, it's good to be back. Toss down your gear. Here you go. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Whoa, this tank's kind of light. I'm just making your job easier, right? My man. How'd we do? How do you think? Full recovery? Every last bit. <laughs> Making the rest of us look bad. Making the rest of you look good. Let me read this. Let's wrap this up later. My hero. <laughs> Come on. Let's go see what you brought us. Hey, so how about you let someone else be point man next time? You've earned a break. No, no thanks. I'll take a dive over being at the office any day. Yeah, well, uh, either way, it's gonna be a while to the next dive. What are you talking about? What about Thursday's job? <laughs> Oh, come on, no. Got under bid. You gotta be kidding me. Hey, competition's tough. Let's see here now. Care to do the honors? Yeah, sure. Thanks. That we struck copper. <laughs> well, you'd be surprised how much this stuff is worth. Clients paying good money for the full cover. Sure, you don't want to just melt it down, and make some pennies. <laughs> Come on, let's go celebrate. First round's on me. Bar hopping with you guys? <laughs> no, 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 not unless there's hazard pay. Uh, if it's all the same to you. I think I'm just gonna do the paperwork and uh, get home and crash. A rain check though. All right, suit yourself. Hey, good work today. Thanks. Copper. Hey, 
Hey, hey, Nate. Nate, hold on. Hey, what are you doing here? Uh, I got a present for you. Present? Yeah. What's this? I got some news from my contact about that wreck off the coast of Malaysia. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, the ship's intact. Yeah? Cargo's right for the piggin'. You are a persistent one, I'll give you that. And all the money came through for the equipment, too. We are all set. Except, uh, my best guy. The guy I trust for the job, the only one. He, he's he got cold feet. My feet were never warm to begin with. And tell me, this contact of yours, you get the permits? No, he did not get the no. permits. Can't no one get the damn permits? Of course not. But, Nate, don't you see that works in our favor? No permits means no competition. The ship is ours. No permits means no go. <sighs> Nate... This is retirement money for the both of us, okay? I don't know about you, but I don't want to be working salvage when I'm 60. Do you? Sure beats prison. No. Listen, I have to pass. And trust me, so should you. Okay, just take it with you. Humor me, I'm okay? not going to change my mind. Well, then don't hurt to sleep on it, does it? Say hi to Carla and the kids for me, okay? All right. No pressure, Nate. But think about it. Really did your homework on this one. Narrow down the search area. It would make a hell of a find. Son of a bitch. <laughs> no, no, no way. You are going with the others. your big brother some years back. Yee, one of the stranger things I've collected along the years. A Spanish doubloon found in a German U-boat in the middle of a jungle. Who would have thunk? Sir Francis Drake takes a bullet for Sully. Look at us. Shambhala. <laughs> Miss you, pal. killed each other for a piece of this. Sir Francis and his elaborate puzzles. Thanks for nothing, St. Dismas. <laughs> now this was a crazy ride. Hmm. Another lifetime, Chloe.
not really my style anymore. Yeah! Here they come. Take cover. I'm surrounded. Bullseye. Take that. And that. Eat plastic. Don't let them flag you, Nate. That'll teach you. See ya. Ah, <laughs> still got it. Hey, Nate, are you coming down to eat? Yeah, yeah, I'll be right there. Well, playtime's over. Is this what you're working on? Well, we really need to go on another vacation. It's been too long. A long time. Well, I was researching something. Oh, is that what we're calling it these days? I was. Hey, would you mind grabbing the food? Oh, yeah, sure thing. There we go. Done. Okay. Oh. Finish it? Yeah. Oh. You know, it's probably too long and full of typos, but that's what editors are for, right? <laughs> God, I'm starving. It looks good. Mm-hmm. So, how was your day? What? Hmm? Huh? We got none of that. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. How was your day? Oh, it was fine. Mm -hmm. Typical day in paradise. Mm -hmm. I uh, I got to pull a bunch of garbage out of a river. Mm. Yes. At least you got to go for a swim. <laughs> Did you find any exciting garbage? Oh, some brilliant stuff. It was a uh, early 21st century truck we got. <laughs> Apparently the natives called it a semi. Oh, dear Lord. Kind of so, it, it, boring stuff. But tell me about the article. 
Well, it started out as this fluff piece about tourism in Bangkok, but I don't think the magazine is going to like the angle that I'm taking because everyone immediately commented about how rude the smog was, that it was like shock to the lungs, like the second that you got off the plane or so. I kind of took this U-turn. Ah! What? Where are you? I'm in here, being stabbed with a fork. <laughs> really? Uh, what? Just keep going. It was, it was interesting. Oh. Yeah. Interesting. What's my article about? What? what this one? Mm-hmm. It's about, you know, the uh, lost city of Bangkok. Not, not of Bangkok, lost city near Bangkok, in or about the city limits of Bangkok. Wow. All right, I'm sorry. No, it was valiant. It I was, was in the really ballpark, right? In a different state, but yeah, you were in a ballpark. <laughs> Jameson asked you about that Malaysia job again. Jameson always asked me about the Malaysia job. Look, Nate, I really think that you should take it. You know what? I don't want it. Really? I mean, he doesn't have the permits. And we agreed we're not going to take that kind of work anymore. It's okay, just not worth it. it. It doesn't sound that risky. All right? If it's just a permit. No way. You could call Sullivan. You haven't but, seen him in about two years. Well, could we please drop this? Okay, I just don't want you to not take it because of me. I'm not taking it because of me, okay? <laughs> I appreciate the gesture. It's just... I'm going to go ahead and do the dishes. No, stop. I'll do them. No, you on. did them last night. No, you cooked. I cleaned. It's fine. I mean, at least at least, uh, let me let me try to earn it or, or something. Let me um, play you for it. You'll play me for yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your little TV game thing. I bet I can beat your high score. You think that you can beat my high score on my TV game thing? Yeah, I think you're scared now. You don't even know what it's called. I don't need to know what it's <laughs> called. I've seen you play. It's right. jumping and running, and I have a natural talent oh, for that. Really? So what do you say, chicken? Is it a bet? Oh, wow. Okay, cowboy. Okay, watch and learn. Oh, I'm learning all right. Is this it? No, it has to load. Load? Yes. This is taking a really long time. You have no patience. When you turn something on, you expect it to... Okay, there we go. <laughs> Crash Bandicoot. Is there a problem? No, no, just, uh... How do you, uh... How do you make it go? Push the start button. I knew that. All right. I got it. Okay, so you want to run towards the camera. Run to the camera, okay. Okay, run away from the boulder. Why is the boulder chasing me? Just run away from it. I did nothing to this boulder. It's jump, jump! Stop yelling at me. I'm encouraging you, I'm coaching you. Keep going, keep going. What is that thing, a fox? A bandicoot. Looks like a fox. It's like a, like a fox in jeans. Okay, smash the boxes. Why is a fox smashing crates? Bandicoot, and that's just, it's what he does. It's a fox, and it's not very realistic. Oh, what happened? You fell in the pit. I don't know. How do I uh, climb back up? You're dead. Well, that's not realistic. I, I would have climbed back up. He should learn to climb. Climbing's always helped me. Perfect. By the way, foxes can't do this. It's a bandicoot. That doesn't look anything like a bandicoot. Have you ever seen a bandicoot? No, but I'm sure they don't wear sneakers. Uh, these graphics are pretty good, aren't they? Is 
that it? You asked for it. Oh. oh you gotta be kidding me. I practically had it. You can give it another shot. Come on, double or nothing. My car could really use a good really? cleaning. Really? You're gonna start yeah. the smack talk There's now? There's this mode called easy mode. I just switch it. Wow. It's way no, easier on no, Just keep mode. talking. Keep talking. What are you gonna do? I'm, I'm warning you. What are you gonna do? You. I'm warning In real life, what hey, can you do? I'm Show me. What can you I'm do in real you. life? What do you think about that? Huh? <laughs> hey, are you happy? Yeah, of course. You? Um. Um? <laughs> really? Come here. Not open yet. We're closed. Come on, man. All right, I'm coming. Coming. Asshole. <sighs> yeah, can I help you? Yeah, I'm uh, looking for my little brother. It's about your height, a little bit leaner. Definitely less gray in the temples. Sam? It's good to see you again, Nathan. God, Sam. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Take it easy, take it easy. <laughs> <laughs> How? How? I thought you... I saw you get shot. Yes, you did. Right there. Huh? Jesus. <laughs> well, the doctors, they... I mean, doctors, they patched me up and they... tossed me right back into the cell. Yeah, but I, I made calls. I, I checked everywhere. I, everything I heard, everything I found, it, it all confirmed you were dead. Well, Nathan, we killed a guard, okay? So they wanted to see me rot in that cell for the rest of my life, and I nearly did. Jesus, Sam, I... Man, if I had known, I, I, I swear to you, I would have you come back. You would have back. come back. I know, Nathan. I know. What's important now, though, is that I'm out. <laughs> Hey, hey, you still with me? I need some air. You're not gonna pass out on me or nothing, I, are you? I just might. It's a lot to digest, you know? But how, how did you get out? When did you get out? How, how'd you even get here, find me? All right, 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 slow down. Have a seat. I want to hear about you. Huh? Me? Yeah. What's to tell? Well, call some of your old contacts. They tell me some pretty crazy ass stories. <laughs> These were crazy stories. Got shot, hanging from a derailed train in the Himalayas. Yeah, that, uh, that actually happened. Come on, man. What did I miss? Jeez, Sam, where do I start? Start with the best part. Uh, do you remember the theory that we had that Sir Francis Drake faked his own death? Yeah, sure. Okay, he did. I found the coffin. Off the coast of Panama? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, now, get this, okay. I open it up, right? right? And there's no body. But the bottom is his old journal. Are you shitting me? I mean, what can I say? Another lost city destroyed, and, uh... We made it out alive. Barely. Unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah, it was. I wish you could have been there. No, it, it's literally unbelievable. You, you tell me you stumble upon yet another archaeological <laughs> gold mine, and somehow you manage to walk away with nothing. Yeah, well, it's a story of my life, I guess. But, you know, I managed to grab a few trinkets here and there. Mm. Paid off the car, the house, engagement ring, the 
Engagement ring. I'm married. I can't believe... Uh, Elena, from the stories, that's my wife. You gotta come meet her. Tonight, dinner, at my place. You're coming to dinner. I can tell her all about you. Shit, I gotta tell her all about you. Nathan, I'm in a lot of trouble here. What? What are you talking about? What kind of trouble? Is the name Hector Alcazar ring a bell with you? Yeah, he's the, the drug lord. Mm -hmm. Butcher of Panama, right? Why? It's a funny story, but uh, last year he was my cellmate. So this is how I got out of prison. You're not reading tonight. Samuel, come here. Listen. The guards, they're singing. Eh, well, they're probably drunk. Perhaps. But they are content. How can they be content with their small lives? Their miserable jobs? <laughs> I mean... They have wives to go home to. What do we got? Huh? No offense. We have ambition. No. <laughs> and when we get out of here, that ambition will take us to places these idiots cannot even imagine. Yeah, well, amen to your optimism. <sighs> what will you do when you get out, Samuel? <laughs> That's if I get out of here. I'm sure you can imagine. I can, but I want to hear you say it. I will find the greatest pirate treasure of all time, which I am sure you are sick of hearing about by now. Oh, no. The tale of Henry Avery and his 400 million in jewels and gold has become a sweet lullaby for me. Do you really think you can find it? Given the opportunity? Absolutely. <laughs> Ambition. What is that Avery quote? <laughs> I am a man of fortune, and I must seek my fortune. I like how he thinks. What the hell was that? The opportunity of a lifetime. Señor Alcázar, un gusto verlo. Segment the key. Oh. ¿Qué hacemos con él? Samuel, are you ready to seek your fortune? Yeah. Vámonos. Holy shit. Los demás están en posición. En camino. Todo va de acuerdo al plan, señor. Fantastic. How long have you had this plan? Since the moment I set foot in this place. Samuel, keep up. We're going to have to move quickly. Holy shit. Pedazo de Combate a la puerta. Nunca saldrás de aquí. Silencio. Jesus. These men are sadistic. We're doing the world a favor, huh? Here. You'll need this. You remember how to use it? Yeah, it'll come back to me. Abran todas las puertas. Hector, you do that, and you'll start a goddamn riot. <laughs> exactly. Háganlo. Stay close, Sammy. Si 
I see. So now what? Estamos en posición. ¿Están listos? Sí. Busquen dónde cubrirse. Samuel, get behind something. What? Why? Just do it. Are you all right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Samuel, take cover! Samuel, in a minute, we will either be free or dead. Are you ready?
Here, sell me a drink. Oh, no, no, I'm good. I'm better than good, actually. <laughs> You're dehydrated. Go on, drink. Thank you. So, what's next for Samuel Drake? Huh? Mm. Jesus, what is next? Uh, I'm gonna take a bath. I'm gonna sleep on a real bed. Mm. Maybe find a nice warm body to sleep next to me. Uh, track my brother down. Seems like a pretty good start. Uh, it is. So, uh, how long? What do you think it would take for you to retrieve Avery's treasure? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I, uh, I get back to the States, I can resume my search. How long? Uh, it's kind of hard to say until I get started. You said you know where it is. Yeah, uh, I do, okay? But listen, it's, it, it's not like Avery left some map with a big red X on it, okay? But I've, I've, I've got some very you think solid. I see Oh, okay. J just, just wait a minute. Take, take, take. Hey, take it easy. I like you, Samuel. More importantly, I believed you. That is why you were here. I can, I can get it. Okay, I, I just need some time. Tell me, Uncle Gio. You see, the problem is. I'm having all these doubts into my mind. Hector, listen to me. I will find it. I swear. <laughs> How long? Six months. <laughs> People are lazy. They always ask for more time than they actually need. Three months. Three months is a bad. Three months. Half the treasure. Can you do it? Say it. Have the treasure. Now, if you run or try to hide the treasure, or do something really stupid like go to the authorities, I'll know. And when you least expect it, I will be there. At that point, death is not a mercy I will grant you. <laughs> Come on. No. The nearest town. It's ten kilometers in that direction towards the sunrise. <laughs> it's been a while since we've seen the sunrise outside, huh? Vamos. When I find it. Then what? Don't worry. When the time comes, I'll be there to collect. Buena suerte, Samuel. Bizarre lets me go, and here we are. This is bad. We just pick up the trail where we left off, and wait, trail? Sam, there's no trail. After Rafe and I escaped, he took his parents' fortune and bought up all the land around St. Dismas Cathedral. We combed that place for weeks. Avery's treasure isn't there. Not that that stopped Rafe. Moron's been digging for years, still hasn't turned up squat. Not really surprised. What does that mean? I just, you know, happened to do a little digging of my own. And, uh, I bet your Rafe doesn't have this. It's really amazing what you can find on the internet these days. It's just the St. Dismas Cross. Oh, is it? Because the one we found was broken and hollow, remember? Holy crap, it's still intact. Avery made more than one cross. So whatever's missing from the one in Panama... ...is probably still inside this one. Mm -hmm. Well, all right. Well, where is this? Oh, this exquisite piece is going up for auction in three days at the Rossi Estate. The Rossi Estate? Well, you know it. Uh, yeah. 
And how do you plan on securing an invite to an exclusive, heavily guarded black market auction? Well, you don't necessarily need an invitation, per uh, se. Huh? Yeah. And uh, where are you going to get the money to outbid all the high rollers? I could take a second mortgage out on my house, and it still wouldn't be enough to... Yeah, you're going to try and steal it, huh? No. We are. Oh, no. No, man, listen, I'm, I can't. I'm, I'm out. What? No, I, I, I just don't do that kind of thing anymore. Besides, there, there are plenty of other guys that are much more equipped to handle this kind of thing. Like who? Um, I don't know, like, uh... Anybody, uh, Charlie Cutter. No. No, he's my no, go-to no, guy no, for this sort of thing. No, absolutely not. I don't trust Charlie or anybody else that you've got on that phone with my life, okay? I need you on this one. Sam, there's got to be another way. Not with the time I got left. Certainly not with Alcazar. Hey, hon, it's me. Yeah, uh, listen, you're not gonna believe this. Jameson just walked in here with the permits. Yeah. I know, I know, but uh, it's like I'm gonna take that Malaysia job after all. See anything yet? Just a bunch of high-class, low-life criminals all cleaned up for prom. <laughs> and no sign from Sullivan yet. Well, there's still plenty of time. Looks like the storage room's in the building behind the manor. Can you see it from up there? Just the very top of it. Oh, I wonder what they got tucked away in there. <laughs> Let's just focus on Avery's cross, okay? No, you sure you don't want to pick up something for the wife? It's cute. Let's keep it simple. Right, simple. And it would be a whole lot simpler if it was just the two of us. Sam. We could be inside already. Not cleanly. Have you even thought about a backup plan in case uh, Sullivan gets cold feet? No, because he won't. Or if he got caught? Sam. He knows the people running the auction. He's gonna schmooze his way right through that party, get upstairs, unlock the window, and we're in. It's a solid plan. Uh-huh. All right, fine. Good, say it. What if he stole the cross for himself? Not in a million years. Victor Sullivan. Say Victor we're talking about, right? Yes, he's double-crossed people in the past, but not us. No, not you. I know you two have never seen eye to eye. Huge understanding. But I trust him, all right? He's family. And... No, 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 no. I just need you to trust him, too. Fine. Fine. He'll come through for us. Eventually. But I mean, come on, you have to at least just for one second consider the possibility. There. See? Trust. Try to keep your tucks clean. Thanks. <laughs> I can't believe I'm out. I can't believe I'm here you mean, with you in Italy, huh? <laughs> Yeah, me either. Just wish the circumstances were less tense, you know? Eh, uh, well... You now the sights are a bit more enjoyable that way. Oh! Uh, so this, this isn't your first time here? No, it's more like, uh, third? Had a couple of odd jobs. With Sullivan? Well, yeah. <laughs> okay.
Man, there's no way up under that bridge. Well, there's that exposed beam underneath. Oh, you think you can rope it? Do I think I can rope it? <laughs> Watch this. I'm watching. I, uh... I missed. <laughs> nah, see, it's, uh, it's all in the wrist. Here, let me see it. Ha! Ah, see? Yeah, it's not bad. For a second attempt. Ah. You see that? Oh, like a pro. It's your turn. <clears throat> okay, so where to next? <clears throat> hey, let's switch places. All right, climb over me. I've, I've got a good grip. Okay. Hey, bet we can swing off that beam up there. Uh, definitely. <clears throat> okay, here we go. <clears throat> First try. All right, no one likes a show-off. Okay, come on, Nathan. It looks like you can uh, climb down and make your way over. Right behind you. attraverso un tubo e forse non potrà più camminare. Ah, bene lista. Ehi, hai scommesso sulla partita? Inghilterra vincente. Inghilterra? Traditore. Ehi, non confondere l'orgoglio nazionale con la realtà. Ok, we're good. Jesus, did you see him? That Renner thug was packing some serious heat. Should have brought guns. Sam, we're gonna pull this off so smoothly, we won't need them. I hope you're right. Ah, all those years. It's the little things that you miss the most. Like what? The smell of fresh citrus. <laughs> uh, riding the motorcycle, it's little things, but they add up. That should hold. All right, come on down. Oof. Ah. <laughs> These landings are a little more painful than I remember. <clears throat> yeah, tell me about it. So, uh, your other wonderful finds, uh, the ones I missed, you at least take any pictures? I wish. Elena filmed some of it, but camera didn't make it. That's too bad. I have some drawings, though. When we get back, I'll show you. You have drawings? What, are they up on the fridge or something? No, I, they're good drawings. I can't wait. I don't see anything to climb here. Ah, 
Yeah, this looks promising. I think you mean precarious. <laughs> Shit! You okay up there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. Suck if you missed right now. It sure would. But I don't miss. million bucks. Let's go. All right, I'm right behind you. Sully? You know what I love about partying with a bunch of crooks? What's that? Nobody cares if you smoke indoors. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while. Too long, boy. Oh. <clears throat> you remember my dead brother, right? Victor? I'll be goddamn. Fifteen years. Yep. Good to see you alive, Sam. Mm -hmm. let's, uh, let's try keeping him alive by getting this cross, huh? Yeah, uh, about that. What, what about that? Come on, let me show you something. Take a look. That's Avery's cross. They brought it out of storage just before you guys got here. They changed the lot order. Take a whole pile of cash to make that happen. All right, well, how long before they start the bidding? 10, 15 minutes tops. Well, there's got to be some way we can grab it. <laughs> there is just a small matter of a few hundred eyewitnesses okay, down there. Okay, okay, but we just need a diversion. Like? Like, um, like I don't know. But there's got to be something. Well, if the guards see us <laughs> making for that cross... But they don't see us. Hmm? Jesus, you guys act like you never spend time in prison. If you want something dirty done, then you wait for, for lights, lights out. out. Yeah. Where's that electrical panel for this place? There's ventilation. Electrical. That's it up here. So we just have to climb up there and kill the lights. Grab the cross in the dark. There will be an emergency generator. And that'll give us a few seconds of darkness to work with. Meaning we'll have to be right next to the cross when the lights go out. Except there's no way we can get that close without being noticed. Scusate, signore. <clears throat> Antipasti? Mosse. Hi. How are you? Ciao. Would you focus? The waiter wouldn't get noticed. That could work. Uh huh? That will work. <laughs> All right. All right, I'll, I'll get to the breaker room and kill the power. You mean I'm the waiter? You're the best pickpocket. What? Right. You head down to the floor, keep your eye on the prize, okay? Let us know if anything uh, hinky goes down. Roger that. All right. Listen, we still got this. Ready? Ready. All right, follow me. We'll cut through the cellar. Gotta say, Victor, the years have been kind to you. Thanks. I chuck it up to going vegans. Really? Squizzy? Ha! <laughs> you kissing me. Hell no. I refuse to be. What are you doing? I'm just going over our exit strategy. It's gonna get hairy. <laughs> Look, relax. We've pulled off tougher heist than this. Yeah, I know, I know. I just... 
Try not to imagine what they'll do if they catch us. Sam, if things go bad, we'll be dead long before they catch us. That's a comforting point. Yeah. You see, I thought I had a reasonable grasp of French, or at least a passable French accent. But then a few months back, I'm with my girlfriend by the Pompidou Center. I've just sold them those pieces we, uh, uh, obtained last year, you know, those hanging, all thing, I don't know, abstract art shit. Anyway, we walk out past that giant ice pool. Sama's just through there. Let's go. This place is fancy. Here's the thing. Of course they play douchey European techno. Monsieur Lanza, do you remember us? Are you still working on repatriating me? locked. Shit, it was open earlier. Now what? Can we pick it? No, it's electronic. We're gonna have to find another way in. You see that? Key card, back left pocket. Yep. I'm on it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You sure you wanna do that? There's a lot of eyes out here. I think I can handle a simple lift. All right. Oh, real smooth. I'm not even trying yet. Yeah, I can tell. Professionals at work. Okay. All right. Let's try this again. We'll still need these. Great. Good luck. We'll be in touch. Hands in the air. I like that. Hello, Nadine. <laughs> Pleasure to see you again. Only this time, I've got the drop on you. Well, I guess I should be glad that's not a real gun. <laughs> Hardly recognize you out of your fatigues. Yeah. You know how it is. Every once in a while, a job requires us to get all dolled up. Looking sharp, by the way. Not too bad yourself. So out of place here. Can't tell you what a relief it is to run into another English speaker. Even if you are American. They'll have to blame my parents for that one. <laughs> I was on my way to the bar. Can I get you something? Yeah, scotch. On the rocks. Be right back. Nate? You catch all that? Yes, I did. Sounds like a lady's trying to buy you a drink. Yeah, Nadine Ross is buying me a drink. Dean Ross. Wait, doesn't she own that army for hire? Is it called Coastline? Shoreline. Yeah, right. But you had a run in with them. It's putting them mildly. Fortunately, she does not seem to be holding a grudge. I'm good to go here. All right. Listen, we're all set, Sully. You uh, stay out of trouble, okay? I'll try. Ready? <laughs> yeah, let's do it. 
find where the waiters and caterers are hanging out. I lure one out of the kitchen, probably. Then let's go find the kitchen. Man, there's enough food down here to feed a small town. This skate wasn't on the blueprint. Locked, of course. Okay, plan B. up there. Nathan, come check this out. You got some? Here we go. Let there be light. Got electrical in this joint. <sighs> Don't suppose you brought a... Yeah, that'll do. It's always a good idea to bring a smoker along. Unless you need to run. Oof. Man, I'm starting to get a little drunk off the fumes in here. Oh, good thing Sully's driving. Maybe the vent access is behind these casks. That's a lot of really rare vintage. Yeah, maybe Alcazar can just settle for some good wine. <laughs> that's something tells me that's not gonna fly. Hey, uh, should be worried that Victor's chatting up Nadine Ross. I mean, heard some pretty scary stories about her crew. Yeah, don't worry about Sully. I can talk his way out of anything. Give me a hand or anything. I'm holding the lighter. Holding the lighter. Okay, up we go. All right, there. That's smaller than it looked, huh? <laughs> and a lot more dusty. Cosa portiamo a quell'odioso miliardario da Dex? Questo è un parrucchino in quella roba sul naso. Pezzi rubati ai ricettatori. F 
Fresh air, here we come. Hey, check this out. See that building with the radio tower? You mean the cell tower? The what? Whatever. Listen, that's the power room. Yeah, you're right. Let's see how we get past this gate. Sam, up here. I'll boost you up. All right. All right. Good thing you kept in shape. There you go. Sully, we just got out of the wine cellar. Heading to the power room now. How's it looking? Sully? You there? Ah, that must be a bad spot for a signal. Hopefully he's doing okay. Bingo. Found the kitchen. And of course it's locked. Sam, look. Maybe we can use that to find a window. Drop into the kitchen. That's a good idea. I'll boost you up and you take care of the ladder. Sera. Ma che sta facendo? Easy on the civilian, Sam. All right. So he waits to put a headache in his underwear. We've both been there before, right? <laughs> right. Well, I got mine. You get yours. All right. Okay, let's get to the power room. Sam, you good? Yeah, these pants are just a little bit too tight. Yeah, well, that's the style these days. Really? No, oh, we're in Rome. Nah, because we're in Italy. I get it. All right, I'm going to head back to the ballroom. <laughs> Not at... <laughs> Sam, you there? Sam? <clears throat> Sully? <clears throat> right. Guys, if you can hear me, I'm just about at the power room. Should be there soon. Ish. you got away with that. Oh, we did not. <laughs> no, we had our liberty taken away for a month. And what about the horse? Fortunately, we had a lot of carrots on board. <laughs> <laughs> Recognize someone? No. I thought I did, but no. But when am I finally going to meet that partner of yours? Drake? Well, that's ex-partner. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've been flying solo for a while now. Drake's out. Oh, like dead out? Oh, no, more like retired. Mm. Last I heard, he settled down, got married. Mm. Well, then he might as well be dead, right? <laughs> Victor Sullivan. Where the hell are you? Rafe. How long has it been? 10 years? 12? 15. <laughs> it's amazing. All these years gone by, here we are, we're still haggling over dead people's junk. <laughs> really? Aren't you running your parents' business? My business now. But yes, that is my day job. 
Oh, that is one hell of a day job. You could probably afford to buy up everything on the block tonight. Well, sure. But what would be the point in that? And these days, I'm only looking for the good stuff. Big scores. Any advice on what I should pick up tonight? <laughs> yeah. I think I want to bid against him. <laughs> but, um... <clears throat> Just between you and me, I did notice they changed the order. Hmm. I think somebody might be trying to rig this auction. Hmm. Well, remember where we are. This crowd didn't get rich by playing fair. Which is why you really need someone watching your back in a place like this. Ah. Well, I do hate to break it to you. You are working for an American. With? We've partnered up on this one. I see. <laughs> Talk about a power couple. In a few moments, we'll begin bidding on our next item, an inlaid wooden crucifix from the Trotty State. Well, I know when I'm a third wheel, you two kids have fun tonight. Just hold on, Sully. How'd you find out about it? It? What it is that, Rafe? Nadine, I think your partner here has had too many bloody marriages. Cut the bullshit, old man. I don't know how you scam your way in here, but if you think about bidding on Avery's Cross, I can tell you exactly how you're going to be leaving in a goddamn Rafe. fight. <laughs> well, you get my point. Lovely seeing you both. Nate? Nate? Where the hell are you? Okay. Power room. I can do this. God, why did I pick the power room? Speriamo di non dover cambiare altri fusibili del cazzo stasera. Direi che per stasera può bastare. Ma che diavolo? Pronto? Here we go. Now, where the hell are the circuit breakers? Ah, oh, crap. Sam, Sully, you there? God damn it, kid, where the hell have you been? I made it. Had a few close calls, but... Yeah, well, if you're gonna cut the power, now would be a good time. Right, well, I'm gonna need a minute before I can reach the panel. We don't have a minute. Rafe's about to walk out of here with your cross. Wait, what? Rafe? Rafe is here? Yes, Rafe is here. And right now, he has the highest bid. Well, I'll bid him. 
With what? Oh, that kind of scratch. Sully, we're stealing, remember? What if he calls my bluff? Uh, he won't. We have 90,000. Do I hear any more bids? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid. We're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Since we have no other bids. Trust me. Going once. Going twice. Scott. Then we have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? We now have 110,000 euros in the room. For a penny and for a pound. That bid brings Don't us worry. to 120. You'll be out of there in no time. I better be. Okay. Just gotta smash the lock. Now the bid has reached 130,000. We are now at 140. Nope. Your bid, Signore, takes us all the way to 150,000 euros. Nothing. Damn it. The bidding stands at 160,000 euros in the room. Signore, it's gotta be something. Come on. Man, uh starting to sweat bullets here. Yeah, give me a sec. We are now at 180,000 euros in the room. Damn it! Bidding has now reached 190,000 euros. Yes! My goodness, we are now at 200,000 euros in the room. The bid is at 210 in the room. <laughs> gotcha! All right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's speed, 230,000 euros. 500,000. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have 500,000 euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to bid again? Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> okay, let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once. Going twice. Then I shall sell it for 500,000. And ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The back of power will come on shortly. It's gone. <laughs> Move it! Get out of the way! Stop him! Hey! Stop that guy! Fermo! What are you doing? You're letting him get away! You speak Spanish. What? Sam, tell me you got the cross. I got St. Dismas right here. You wanna say hi? Yeah, we really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security's scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around. Falso allarme. Oh boy. These guys are everywhere. Okay, maybe we should have brought guns.
Aspetta. C'è qualcosa laggiù? Sì. Penso tu abbia ragione. Ho trovato qualcosa? Gotta climb and get a good vantage point. Merda. Se riescono a svegliarsela, non ce la faranno. Li troveremo e li riempiremo di buco. Ma sappiamo cosa fare. Resta concentrato. D'accordo. Oh. All right. On my way. Heading to higher ground to get my bearings. All right, see you soon. Yeah. Front. Yeah. Okay. Everything's fine. No one got a good look at me. Just gonna play cool. Stroll right on out of here. Scusi. You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what, I won't tell anyone if you don't. You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. Really? Well, I'm flattered, but I'm afraid I'm spoken for. If you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I were... I would... You won't. All right, fine. Just remember, I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. Nice try. I gave you that one. Freebie. Come here. Now hand me the artifact. Do you know how many artifacts I've collected over the years? You're gonna need to be more specific. Let me see if I can clarify. All right, look. I'm still a little jet lag. Oh, son of a... Have you had enough? Or do you want to keep being a smart ass? Well, you know. Being a smart ass has gotten me this far in life. Why quit now? Alright, wait, wait! It's in my back pocket. Where is it? Right there. Just met your friend Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this round sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. The good news is I got a gun. See you soon. <laughs> Lassù, su 
in there <laughs> I can't get to you from here you got a way down yeah yeah I think so okay I'll meet you at the driveway just head towards the ballroom all right see you there Prima o poi ti troverò. Almost to the ballroom. Nathan, I'm pinned down in here. You can use a hand. On my way, Sam. Oh, good. Yeah. <sighs> 
I hope I don't go to hell for this. Shit. What? It's empty. What? Oh, you're such an <laughs> asshole. He's your brother. All right. Skull and crossbones. Very good sign. Xavier's insignia. What is this? Uh, Odie mecum eris. In paradise. Today you will join me in, in paradise. paradise. It's what Jesus said to Saint Dismas on the cross. Right. But what about these numbers here? What do, what do you make of this? It's some kind of code or a phone number. <laughs> Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. It's the year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. Well, uh, by most accounts, yeah, but. 
It means we have date of birth, date of death, and paradise. Which means we're looking for Avery's grave. St. Dismas's Cathedral. <laughs> Wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now, look at this. The layout of this place is really unusual. Uh. Here's the cathedral, but the graveyard is way over here. Rafe's been focusing on the wrong area. Exactly. Guys, we're going to Scotland. All right, all right. Wait, wait up. You do realize that Rafe knows you're coming. Yeah, we can deal with that when we get there. Look, that psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. Plus, he's got Nadine and her whole army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. But come on, it's both, right? We need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all this? Oh, Jesus, kid. Look, it's just not that simple. Look, with all that you two have been through together... She wouldn't understand this. You are not giving her enough credit. I can't take that chance. <clears throat> Nathan, he's right. Things have changed. Rafe's involved now, and... I can, I can take this on my own, really. Great. Well, thank you for your input, both of you. Excuse me. Hey. Hey, it's me. Yeah. Now the reception's lousy. Yeah. Something on your mind, dear? Look, I, uh, I realize it couldn't have been easy. All those years away. And I'm sorry for what happened to you. <laughs> But it's not his fault. I never said that it was. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. You see a gun to his head? He chose this. Okay, he's meant for this life. You really believe that? Why are you here, Victor? Because somebody's got to keep an eye out for him. No, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Yeah, I will. Okay. I love you, too. Bye. Just told her that the job was going to take a little longer than expected, which is the truth. Right? So come on, what do you say? Sam could still use our help. Well, <clears throat> I do hear that the weather is particularly fine in Scotland this time of year. Oh. Rafe's really going all in, isn't he? Well, they're all concentrated around the cathedral, so that's good. Because we are gonna have that graveyard all to ourselves. <sighs> Sully. Yeah? Hey, listen, we're good to go here. Okay, kids. Happy hunting. Last chance to come with. Yeah, well, unless you can find me an escalator, I think I'll pass. <laughs> all right, see you in a few. Uh, hey, Nate. Yeah. Just, uh... Ah, just bring me back something shiny, will you? That's the plan. Well, let's go pay our respects to Captain Avery, huh? Scottish Cathedral. <clears throat> Strange place to bury your treasure, no? Uh, not really. I mean, by the time Avery would have sailed here, the place was already abandoned. I guess that's true. Plus, with the massive bounty on his head, and a good place to hide. So, uh, what happened between you and Rafe? Nah, I couldn't deal with him. I'm pretty sure he'd had enough of me. I was still coming to grips with your uh, death and with his frustration from not finding the treasure. I'm pretty sure he was ready to kill me by the time I bailed. <laughs> Imagine what he want to do to you now. Yeah, <laughs> try not to. <laughs> Sam, listen. He's ruthless. I mean, even more so than when we teamed up with him.
Yeah, I've heard stories. Hey, this should hold. Good call. What the hell is all this? It's excavation equipment. Shoreline? What? Look. I thought they were just by the cathedral. Oh, shit! Get out! <laughs> Good. Yeah. Nice to meet you too, Shoreline. Seems like they were expecting us. And like they're searching away from the cathedral. Which means we should get to that graveyard pronto. Exactly. Why didn't you guys search beyond the cathedral? Oh, we did. A little. This place is so big, without knowing where to look. It's like shooting in the dark. More like blowing shit up in the dark. What is this place? The monks had several living quarters. Main one being by the graveyard, of course. <laughs> yeah, location, location, location. More shoreline equipment. Uh, at least no shoreliners. Well, maybe we'll get lucky and they'll blow themselves up. <laughs> now, what do you bet? Yep. Dynamite. Yeah, be careful with that stuff, huh? <sighs> hey, got the door open. That was... very loud. Hopefully they didn't hear us. Uh, hopefully we just blend in with the other explosions. Look, there's a way up through the roof. It's too high for a boost, though. So let's find something to climb on? Yeah. this to climb out of that building. Nothing. Are you Please. right, Nathan? Nothing. I've got side one. Get side three. Yeah, okay. <laughs>
go, go! Nicely done. That could have been bad. Yeah. Let's get out of here before anyone checks in on them. There. Come on, let's go. Got it. Oh, careful. I can hook that. There. Whew. All right, you think you can do that? What are you talking about? I taught you that move. All right, let's see it then. There. You see? That was clumsy. <laughs> Sam, there's a ladder just out of reach. All right, hold on. I'll come over. Give me a boost. Come here, I'll pull you up. Thanks. All right, there it is. A monk storm. Just a hop, skip, and a jump away. Uh, don't jinx us. Down we go. <laughs> Burns a little. Huh. Those are fun. <laughs> Do this all day. It gets colder. I'm gonna take a leak while you educate our young creature. So what happened next? Did he put down the robot? No. With our help, he kept it at bay. Nice Once one. money ran out, well, no get the left one. I got right. right. And the general didn't even last the night. <laughs> Cold bastards. As Nadine says, business is business. Whatever gets us more action. I could use a good coup right now. We're gonna have to do better than that, fellas. Let's see if we can keep this up. You two done prepping the site? Cemetery is ready for rich boys. They're not slowing down, are they? They didn't want the results, she wanted them yesterday. Have they found any? Well, they uncovered some stuff, but I don't know the details.
What's that? Kind of hairy. Someone was bound to hear all that. Come on, let's get a move on. Right beyond those walls. Here we go. Easy, bro. I nearly blew my goddamn arms off only to get chewed out by that prick. I should have popped him. The guys fronting our entire crew. What do you think Nadine would do to you? I was following her order. Still, what do you think she'd do? Turn me inside out. Exactly. Take some deep breaths and go walk it off. Stroppy prick. Thinks he can tell me how to do my job. The American sure isn't making any friends. Well, as long as his money's good, that's fine by me. You think Drake's gonna show up? Nadine seems to think so. I'd love to see him and his crew make an appearance. And that goes for all of us. Keep going. Look at that view. <laughs> Whoa, 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 whoa! 
boat. If he did it, I can do it. <laughs> Better than bungee jumping. Have you ever been bungee jumping? No, but I'm sure this is better. So, this is what you've been up to all these years? Jumping around ruins? Yeah, that and getting shot at. Blown up, punched, kicked. All right, all right, I get it. Knifed, drugged. <laughs> That's that. Uh, not quite. Still gotta climb higher across the ravine. I hope we're done sliding for a while. My ass is full of gravel. There's a dormitory gate. Hey, give me a hand. Look at this place. Welcome to the St. Dismas Dormitory. Alleged final resting place of one Henry Avery. <laughs> Let's find that grave. Nathan, check it out. This one's got a pair of cutlasses. It's like the scroll from the cross. The dates aren't right. Well, one down and a hell of a lot to go. Okay, cross cutlasses, skull and crossbones, and the date 1659 to 1699. We find a tombstone with all three, and we're in business. Well, let's desecrate some graves. Let's. No, this is not the grave we're looking for. This one doesn't have a skull and crossbones. <clears throat> Look at this one. Tempus edax rarum. Time devours all things. Jeez, cherry bunch of folks we got here. <laughs> no swords. Ah, oh, this isn't it. Ooh, the swords match. Let's see. Nope. Bad dates. <laughs> huh. Date is correct, but the swords are upside down. Wrong one. <clears throat> no, wrong date, and the swords don't match the scroll. Nope, no cross swords. Not our guy. Yeah, well, 
the swords are a match. So is the ear. Sam, come here. Where'd you find it? <sighs> Benjamin Bridgman. That's Avery's alias. <laughs> Something odd about this skull, though. It's like it doesn't belong to the stone. I mean, what's odd about it is that's not Avery's sigil. Huh. Yeah, I mean, the skull should be facing... Sideways. What is that? My God. <laughs> you ready for this? I've been ready for a long time. Let's see what we got. It's a crypt. A crypt hidden behind a secret door? I assume the secret door was added afterwards. <laughs> to hide his loot. Well, fingers crossed. Oh, ho, ho. gang's all here. Jesus? Dismiss on the left. Penitent thief. Guest is on the right. Jerk thief. <laughs> Avery sure had a thing for St. Dismas, huh? Well, Avery fancied himself a good thief, right? Only plundered and murdered the non-British evens. <laughs> Guess that's what passed for good back then. <laughs> good enough. Some kind of lamp. Hey, Smokey. Need your lighter over here. You know, that hurts my feelings. Not as much as it hurts your lungs. Thank you, Father Duffy. Isn't that something? Oh. <laughs> the light's coming from the other side of the wall. Check it out. There's something at the base of the statues. Uh, let's see here. Ah, uh, I can aim the lights. Hey, here we go. I think you got that one. Oh, connect the dots. There we go. Nathan, that's it, you got it? Okay, let's give this a shot. <sighs> Wrong treasure. Josh. <laughs> well, nice view. No treasure, though. No, but... Look, you see those crosses? Oh, uh, yeah. Hey, is that a cave? Right below? Yeah, I think Avery's trying to tell us where to go next. Uh, there's one problem, though. Going back that way means we have to go back toward the cathedral. And back towards Rafe. Shit. Well, let's not keep him waiting. Follow my lead. Anybody heard from the sky party uphill? 
You think we have guests? Don't I wish. The storm has been messing with the radios. They're practically useless. If we don't get back from them soon, we'll go check it. Okay. I can't believe he got away. Adam, she tossed him out of a five-story window. And he survived. <laughs> Jesus. Guy should count his blessings. That auction was fully guarded. Not by Shoreline. And not by our boys. All I'm saying is let's not underestimate these guys. Let's not make them into something they're not either, eh? Okay, I think we're clear. Well, that could have gone better. Hey, well, we're still breathing. That's good enough. Let's just get that gate open. Okay, you ready? Kind of hoping to find the treasure back there, but it's, never that ah! right? it's been my experience. Plus, there was that cool constellation. Yeah, it was cool. I 
get under that high cross. That's where Avery wants us. Well, what Avery wants, Avery gets. Hey, Sully. We're on the trail, but the uh, treasure's closer to the cathedral than we originally thought. Ah, oh boy. So what do you need me to do? Uh, just keep those engines warm. We'll be back before too long. You got it. Keep me posted. Will do. should appreciate the downtime. Nobody wants another Port Moresby on our heads. How about don't talk if you weren't there, eh? Everything's called a massacre nowadays to generate buzz. We don't need that kind of press. We don't need rival companies stepping into our jobs. You know what? Forget it. Why'd you bring it up then? I said forget it. Whatever, man. I guess there's no getting away from these guys. Yeah, and there'll only be more as we get closer to the cathedral. Okay, coming. Here we go. Come on, I'll boost you up there. All right. Oh, hell, I'm too high to reach you. Yeah, hang on a sec. Hanging. See what's by that wooden structure over there. Hey, I got something. Yep, here we go. Christ, this thing's heavy. What exactly are you doing? Giving you a way up. That'll support even your weight. Ah, thank you. You don't think the monks built this? No way. It's some kind of pulley system. Uh, to lift a whole bunch of treasure? To lift something. I can't believe I missed this. Yeah. Clearly we were meant to find it together. <laughs> oh, so romantic. Save your strength, huh? Not done yet. Just lead the way. Hope this holds.
Or something after all those years of Panama. Hold on. I'll help you up. There you go. Where would you be without me, huh? Uh, probably at home. Drinking hot cocoa? What are you, five? Oh, tell me you wouldn't go for some hot cocoa right now. Well, then, yeah. Exactly. Here we go. So we're done with these idiots. Yeah. Hey, careful. Might be unstable after the blast. Who does excavation with dynamite? Mercenaries. I think Rafe would know better, though. Hey, Sam, help me with this. Uh, well, what if it's the only thing holding the tunnel up? Then I'll apologize. All right. <laughs>
there. See? No problem. Yeah, for once. Hey, be extra careful on these. No oh, crap. Huh. Remember, extra careful. Thanks. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. About to head into the cave. Cave? Yeah, might lose contact for a bit. Don't get too worried. All right, I'll keep the porch light on for you. All right, call you soon. <sighs> we made it. It's quite the detour. Well, let's go see what Avery left for us. Yes, please. Those shoreline assholes were right next to this cave. Yeah, but I think we're the first ones in here. Oh, cold. Come on, through here. I didn't eat a big breakfast. Creepy St. Dismas statues, check. Carved stairs, check. Nathan, I think it's safe to say we're in a pirate cave. Come here. Check this out. A little slimy. There's a handle in here or something. Well, give it a give it a pull. What? Could be a trap. You're already in there. What's the what's the worst that could happen? Uh, I lose my hand. So we'll get you a nice hook. Give it a pull. <sighs> nice hook. All right, here we go. Really? Hello, hello. It's pretty interesting decor. For those who prove worthy, paradise awaits. To those who prove false, behold your grim fate. Yeah, well, I guess Avery was a better pirate than a poet. This... this isn't Avery's. What do you mean? Look. It's the Rhode Island Pirate. Thomas too. Yeah, but it can't be him. I mean, this is clearly his sigil, but two died attacking the same treasure fleet as Avery. Yeah, well, at least that's what the stories tell us. If this really is two's mark, then that means he's involved in all of this how? It's a damn good question. So who do you think these guys are? Those who prove false, I guess. I think Avery or Thomas, too, are just trying to scare us. Good thing we're jaded treasure hunters. <laughs> Good thing. Looks about as safe as the others. Well, it's held up this long. It's okay, it's holding. Come on.
These bridges are clearly not built to code. Sure they are. The pirate code. <laughs> not bad. We're not going back that way. Uh, at least we didn't get dropped in a pit or something. This is... elaborate. You could say that. Found another... Yeah, I'm just gonna take the... hand... out! Whoa. Jesus. It's a pretty elaborate... test? Trial? Yeah. And this guy clearly failed. Then let's do better. There's something on the bottom there. It's a bucket. Huh. Okay. Now what? Ah! Bucket filled. All right, pass it up to me. I'll put it back in that big wheel thingy. All right, let's see what these wheels do. Okay, I think I see what's going on here. Something with the three crosses? Yeah. I'm guessing we're looking at Jesus, our good thief Dismas, and the jerk thief Gestus. I figure the white cross is Dismas, so the black one is Gestus. Hey, check it out. Something up there moved when you put the bucket on top. There's a channel running from the mechanism to the door. Okay. Bucket on top is good. Keep it there. Okay, that's gotta be it. Now let's find out. Let's? So you're gonna pull the switch? Oh, no, no. I'd, I'd hate to deprive you of that privilege. Of course. today so if that was a test what do you suppose it was testing exactly filling a bucket I had to know about st. Dismas whom I bet Avery and all of his crew were intimately familiar with <laughs> not that hard of a test maybe it's not the only one Hey, come here. I'll boost you up there. Coming. Okay, I got something for you up here. Use this to reach those handholds on the wall over there. Good call. Uh, 
Follow me! Yeah, they're sure not making this easy, are they? I imagine it was easier when all the bridges and walkways weren't broken. <laughs> I guess we're a couple hundred years late. Let's see what's in here. There's a low ceiling here. Watch it. Ow! Watch my ah? Can it? I see some light through here. Ah, oh, catacombs. Well, that makes sense. I mean, we're under a cathedral. Anything noteworthy by the dormitories? Not unless you count some cleverly worded headstones. Have you finished digging by the chapter house? We have, ma'am. The northwest sites are wide open as well. And what about the southern perimeter? Not yet. It'll take us a day to move the crane over there. Nadine. Make it happen. In the meantime, see what you can dig up without it. I'll send a couple of men over right away. Good. Rafe, any luck with those manuscripts? Can we have a minute? Keep me updated. Yes, ma'am. Did you hear? They found a whole annexed area under the cathedral. I did. Have you seen it? No. Why? Because there wasn't much left after they'd finished finding it. My men have been a bit liberal with They're the garden like life. a hundred well-armed bulls in a china shop. But they've made more progress in two days than we've made in months. Progress? I can't analyze rubble. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I'll let them know they need to give you a heads up before they do anything drastic. Or you can tell them to sit tight until I analyze the few clues that haven't been blown up. No, we can't sit around waiting any longer. All due respect, I think I have a bit more experience with this sort of thing than you do. We tried things your way. Bullshit. You've been wanting to level this place ever since we got here. No! I wanted to steal that cross long before it ever even made it to that auction. The same auction where I couldn't have my men around to deal with any surprises. The auction was the cleanest way but to get the cross. But instead of going with my gut, I listened to you. And now we have competition. Oh, well, I didn't think he'd show up. Or maybe you wanted to draw him out. <laughs> Why the hell would I do that? Because you think you need him. And maybe you do. Point is, I'm done trying to do things the clean way. If the treasure is here, we'll find it. And if not, well... Maybe it's time to move on, huh? It's not personal. Of course. I'll let you know if anything turns up. Let's get moving before they blow that treasure to bits. Oh, it's not making out. <laughs> hey, wait. You think she was right, though? But what? Rafe want to draw you out. As long as he doesn't get the upper hand, who cares? Doesn't matter. What annexed area you suppose they were talking about? It's got to be some side chamber because we're the only ones here. Me? Well, 
Uh, a little too high to jump up there unless you got a trampoline. <laughs> Left it in my backyard. I'm done. Hey, do, you, do you have a trampoline? I wish. Hang on. Oh, look at you. One crate coming up. I thank you, good sir. Definitely getting closer to the cathedral. You gotta say, this is far more sophisticated than I was expecting. <laughs> Me too. Must have taken years to build. Spared no expense to hide 400 million bucks. Bridge is out. Gotta find another way across. Here goes nothing! <clears throat> Good thing you're not heavier than the crate. Okay. We can hook our ropes onto this. That'll work. Needs bridges. Oh no, I I wouldn't mind bridges per se. Well, can't go through there. So how do we get through? Over here. Look at that. If this place wasn't completely falling apart, we'd probably be trapped again. Nathan, look around you. Holy crap. Must have been another test, but it all just crumbled into the ocean. Well, I guess the test now is how the hell do we get to the other side? <laughs> What's this? That really safe-looking wooden seesaw thing might do the trick. Worth a shot. Well, here goes nothing. Nathan, Nathan, stop. You won't make it. You're too long. I'll weigh it down. Go. <laughs> Made it. All right. Uh, now, what about me? Right. Just let me look around. Cool. Cool. I'll just hang out here. Check out all that machinery. You know, it really makes you appreciate everything that goes into making one of these death traps. <laughs> Don't be glib. Being glib, this is a marvel of human engineering. Any luck? 
Yeah, give me a sec. Okay, I found something to weigh down the seesaw. Excellent. You sure that'll work? It's heavier than I am. I don't know about that. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Oh, no. Hey, nice aim. Oh, crap. I got you. There, thanks. There's another test down. Yeah, at this point, I'd rather take another death trap. At this point, I hope we're at the end of this thing. Okay, getting a bit dramatic with the statues here. Seriously, why decorate a treasure burial site? Or build elaborate tests? Ugh. I'll never get used to this. Another cross. <laughs> At least this one has some jewels on it, right? Whoa, whoa, don't touch it. What? Why? <laughs> Look at it. It's the only valuable thing we've seen in this cave. Right. This is another test. Agreed. Yeah. Or lack thereof. Okay, so. It's, it's gotta be the coins. Yeah. You sure about this? Oh, pretty sure. Pretty sure we'll have to do. Right, just, just one now. Great, I got it. Please don't be a trap. Recognize the shape? It's Madagascar. Look, star right here. It's King's Bay. Yes, it is. <laughs> Son of a bitch. He's screwing with us. What are you talking about? Avery, he's screwing with us. This was supposed to be it, so where's the goddamn treasure, huh? I mean, King's Bay, great. Well, what's next? North Pole? Outer space? Nathan. For those who prove worthy, paradise awaits. He, he was recruiting. Who was recruiting? Avery was recruiting. Recruiting for what? <laughs> <laughs> You gentlemen are very, very noisy. Guns on the floor. Slowly. Must have you from last time. Uh, throwing me out a window didn't do it for you? Rafe. Rafe, come in. I'm at the graveyard. Nadine, hey, we're here. Yeah, I'm looking at them right now. What? Where are you? Come back to the cathedral. Follow the holes. I'm on my way. And for God's sakes, don't shoot him yet. <laughs> Not want to hurry then. King's Bay. Yeah, but, uh, where in King's Bay? You'll need that cross over there to figure it out, but there's only two people that can tell you how to use it. Let me guess. You two. I'm gonna leave it to Rafe. You're gonna be waiting a long time. Sorry, boys. I'm not here to negotiate. Bring me the crucifix. It's not a crucifix. What? Well, technically, a crucifix refers to cross the... You know what? Never mind. Don't touch it!
the plan. We're working on it. Story. Short version is get us the hell out of here. Yeah, drink it. Hold tight. Be there as soon as I can. Sam! What's the turret?
Yeah, set her down. One way or another, we'll get to you. Keep running! Don't stop! Close one, huh? They shot up my goddamn plane, Mason. We're fine, thanks. How soon can you get us to Madagascar? No treasure, then. Not yet. I don't know what you're talking about. Look, we're rich. Jesus. I suppose it's a start. You think the rest is in Madagascar? Well, there was a chamber back there with a giant map of Madagascar on the floor, so... Yeah, it's probably there. This is beginning to smell a whole lot like wild goose, kid. Look, the treasure was never in Scotland, okay? Then what was the point of all that, huh? Of the St. Dismas Look, Cross? it's like I said. I think Avery was recruiting people. The cross was an invitation. The caves were just some sort of uh, initiation. Oh, so we all passed, huh? Congrats, Victor. We get eye patches and parrots now. I don't get it. Why the hell would they go to all that bother just to weed people out? To protect himself. Look, Avery was the most wanted man in the world at that time. He had to enlist people that he could trust in order to keep their treasure secret. What do you mean, their treasure? Just think about this. Thomas II was a successful pirate in his own right. What would he possibly stand to gain from joining Avery? I think Avery sent out crosses only to the other wealthy pirates like himself. What if they pooled and hid all their treasure together? That would make the guns way all look like chump change. Exactly. Oh, holy shit. Okay, so where exactly in Madagascar are we going? Kings Bay. It was an old pirate haven back in uh, Avery's time. I know it well. It's a big place. Anything more specific? Well, that map chamber completely caved in, so, you know. 
<laughs> what are you laughing about? The people who survived the caves, the recruits. What's the one thing they would have left with? There's a volcano on this. There's a volcano near King's Bay. Which means we need to get a move on. Hey. Hey, Nate. Hi, honey. Oh, hi. I've been trying to get a hold of you. Are you okay? Yeah, of course. What do you mean? Well, you know, the news, there's been all that flooding. Maybe going to Malaysia during the monsoon season wasn't such a good idea. Yeah, right. Right, yeah, it, uh, it grounded us for sure. You know, had some equipment failure, but, you know, no one's hurt or anything. Well, as long as you guys are safe. So are you going to start work tomorrow? Uh, postponed, actually. Uh, looks like we're going to need maybe another 10 days or so. Ugh, 10 days? Hey, well, I, why don't I just uh, go ahead and buy a ticket then? Oh, uh, you know, you don't have to do that. It's fine. I mean, you know, these guys always overestimate things. I'm, I'm sure it'll be less time than that. Okay, well, you know, don't rush. Make sure that you're safe. Oh, I will. Always do. Uh, listen, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I gotta go. Jameson's calling me over. Okay. I love you. Love you, too. What are the satellites saying, Victor? Right now, not a goddamn thing. I lost the signal. Hey, you know what never loses signal? Paper. All right, this route right here should take us straight to the volcano. Might get a little bumpy, though. Let's get the show on the road. Okay. All right. The map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. One of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. Fingers crossed. I see some ruins up ahead. Wait here. I'll go take a look. Oh, Victor, you still do a lot of traveling these days? Yeah, I try. I tend to pick jobs that get me away from the computer. <laughs> yeah, I was telling Nathan it's shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to get rid of hot cargo and help. Yeah, sure, but I prefer talking to clients face to face. Get a good read on them. Hard to do that in a chat room talking to some guy uh, named Antiquity Master here. 37. Well, ah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. Okay, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is gonna erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest format. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. Would you look at that? A secret cave behind a waterfall. Gentlemen, we are on a pirate adventure. What are you, seven? So, Victor, how is it that you know King's Bay so well, huh? Well, first time out here was for a swap. Of course. Deal went bad and I got arrested. <clears throat> I'm bribing the police chief. The 
again. And in the process of negotiating the bribe, we, uh, we hit it off. We made it a point to visit him. Well, maybe we can preempt any trouble we might get into. Can you still reach out to him? Her. Oh, mistake. It's a note. It wasn't like that for once. We just saw the world in similar ways. Besides, she moved. Brazil. It's been a few years since we've seen each other. Well, maybe time for a visit. Maybe. First, let's wrap this up. All right, let's get moving. A little warning next time. Yeah, it's the first time in years I've had two showers in one day. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go! Made it. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. I just keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on. Ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Onward and upward. All right, hang on, guys. You need traction here. Don't spin out now. Nathan, the rocks. I got it. I got it. Let's not get stuck here. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. There we go. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, my spine. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy about? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 four four with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off-road. It might rain, might be muddy. I bet we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch. All right, hang on tight. Oh, Gee. shit. You take this slow, kid. Yeah. So, Nathan, you're thinking Avery, too, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? British authorities were closing in on them. Sure. Maybe uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. And go. And no. That was a valiant effort. Go check out that tower. I'll come with. It's in pretty good shape or something, several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. Sam, look. That's Christopher Condon's sigil. He's uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon, operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to 
What, be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. Well, maybe each captain was responsible for a tower, well, along with providing the men for it. Well, whatever the case, this certainly isn't our final stop on our tour. <laughs> stripped away. Something was wrapped around this tree. <laughs> hey, did you know our car came with a winch? No, oh, really? I didn't know. What you gonna do with it? Not sure yet. Do it. Whoa, whoa. Uh, well, that looked like fun. Steeper than it looks. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. You just imagine, you've come here a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. <laughs> Those poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. It's taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor. Patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Sam. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a form of squid. The point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah. Well, it's still taking a long time. How oh, would you look at that? Oh, shit! Stop! Stop! Sam. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. That means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. We do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. Let's go, gentlemen. It's gonna be a hot, hot day, and we have lots to do. Those Drake boys show their pretty faces. You all know what to do. Wait. How's it? You have that dungus hooked up yet? We're all set up. Just waiting on approval from Nadine to blow it. Good. Life's looks empty. Want to get it over with and move on. Whoop! No way I imagine that. All right, then.
shave. Find you. Heads up. Okay, I think that's it. God damn it. Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? 
Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than rape? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of mercenary. The rape's got the advantage there. Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. This thing in the same damn thing. What if they found the treasure already? Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Hey, Sam. You don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard... I... Hey, is that a well? Well, well, well. <laughs> Get it? You know, because it's a well. Sully, you stole your joke. I noticed. <clears throat> what have we here? Did you find something down there? Maybe. Do me a favor, get behind the wheel for a sec. Hey, Sully, throw the car in reverse. Nothing major. I'll show you back at the hotel. What were you saying, Nate? Oh, uh, right. If you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. <laughs> I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. You know, come to think of it, I actually dealt with Alcazar a few decades ago, even before I met you two. Oh, shit. How are you still alive? Well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Still working his way up the criminal ladder then. I sold his boss a few woodcut prints I'd smuggled out of Japan. He was into shoguns and such. Alcazar was the go-between. What was he like? Soft-spoken, but intense, like you could explode at the slightest provocation. <laughs> well, he hasn't changed much then, has he? I got my money and got the hell out of there. Brace for impact! Who wants to do that again? No? So, fire walks into a bar. Oh, great. Here we go. And he's got the steering wheel sticking out of his crotch. All right. So the bartender goes, hey, man, what's with the wheel? And the pirate says back, Ah, it's driving me nuts. <laughs> ah, I love that one. Don't make me leave you out here. <clears throat> this thing come with airbags? Parachutes?
Looks like Shoreline found something. Go slow. You got it. Check it out, boys. What is it? You can probably see all of King's Bay from up here. Yeah. Hey, look. There's the city. And there's the river valley. I'll let you look at this. Quite the view. I just keep waiting to wake up and find myself in solitary or something. <laughs> it's all some kind of dream. Sam. Oh, no, no guilt trip. I'm just... Let's go find this thing. You bet. So, how are you doing? Yeah, still in one piece. I appreciate you coming along for the ride. And especially for negotiating with that rental guy. <laughs> no problem. Hell, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't enjoying myself. <laughs> Me too. Hey guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? I can't tell. We got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Drawbridge? How medieval. Yeah. Well, you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to keep people out. Or protect something inside. Recognize this one? I do, actually. Anne uh, Bonnie. Uh, hmm? Operated out of the Caribbean. I thought she died in jail. At least that's what the stories tell us. <laughs> right. Avery must have invited her, too. must have been here before. Finders keepers. Sounds good. Hey, be careful, kid. <laughs> a 
busted. There's no way after the drop. <laughs> All right, I'll see if there's something up here. Hey, guys, there's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. All right, I'm up. Careful. Sam, special delivery. Ah! Hey, kid, you all right? I'm fine. You all right? Yeah. You got this? Mm-hmm. I see you. I'll bring the car closer. <laughs> You just relax. I got this. I mean, there's only one prank, you know. Keep up the good work, kid. Get that bridge down. Let's try that again. Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? <clears throat> no. 
I'm not to nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? Well, it was worth a try. Let's take a look around. So just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist. Which is worth 400 million. Right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure in play. Well, you should have told him it was 200,000. You never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. I wasn't exactly expecting to be part of it. There we go. We're all set. Here we go. Fun, right? Yeah, well, I'm definitely sharing this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. The whole thing under control. Hold on to something. Ah, ah that was a nice change of pace. Yeah, I'm almost disappointed. Uh, uh, almost. Now, let's find our way in. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. Hmm. Can't get in that way. Uh, Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. See what we got here. Huh. Looks like there's something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Damn. It's breaked over. All right, let's look around. Careful with that thing, kid. Uh. Heads up! God, Jesus! I said heads up! He's got a lot riding on this. Whoa. 
Magnificent. Don't see a treasure, though. Hey, guys? Coming! <laughs> Come check this out. St. Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas, too. And that's, uh. Um... That's Adam Baldridge. That's uh, Joseph Farrell. And that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh. Let's see, what do you think the trick is here? Gotta push a button, pull something? Uh, maybe. Maybe one of the arms or. Give it a shot. <coughs> Come on. Boys, whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. Trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Victor, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so... If we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's got to be in one of them, right? Yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here. Let's hope so. You okay? Yeah, yeah, fine. Sam? Yeah, over here. Hey, what are you doing? It's confirming a suspicion. <laughs> Shit. Look at this. They figured out the towers, too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed. Okay, because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Well, that's great, Nathan, because neither do we. Yes, we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. Still, 
two beats the hell out of 12. All right. I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that one. No, 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 no. no, no. Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Uh, Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. Damn it. Uh, if you run into any of those shoreline clowns, you call us, okay? See you soon. Come on, Nate. We gotta hurry. Yeah. All right, there's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the middle of a goddamn market? Oh, yeah, that'd be crazy. But we've seen crazy before. That we have. Hey, Room. Hey, here we go. Locked. I guess we're gonna have to sneak in. Discreetly? Implied by the use of the word sneak. Sorry. Hey, check it out. That window over there is broken. Hey, Sully, I think we can squeeze through here. That'll work. <laughs> Jesus. <clears throat> Long way down. <sighs> you okay back there? You keep your pace. I'll keep mine. <clears throat> okay, let's see what we got. Edward England's sigil, just like the map said. So what are we looking for? Good question. Yes. Yes, it is. Hmm. Now, what do you bet? Call us. They don't have the best coverage in this city. Well, no reason to wait. I'll be right back. 
Fingers, Nate. Can I be nervous? No, I'm good. Trust me. Where have I heard that before? Leo. I dated a Leo once.
That was fun. Wow. This is a nice view. Ah, here we go. Turn back time. Look at There you are. I sure hope you're doing okay out there, Sam. Jesus Christ. Hey, Sally. Oh, shit. At least I got the door open, though, huh? <laughs> That's one way to do it. You all right? I don't know yet. You? Deaf? Come on. Let's see what Avery has in store for us. All right. Sure, why not? Let's see what's down here. Fingers crossed for piles of gold and jewels. Sam, finally, you okay? Just search my towel, I, I got nothing. Yeah? No, we're definitely in the right place. Make your way over here. Are you serious? Uh, okay, I'm on my way. He's coming. Good. Uh, 
Sully. Way ahead of you. Whoa. Hey, are those our boys? Yep. Henry Avery, Thomas too. Partners in crime. Founders. Founders of what? Worst scavenger hunt ever? <laughs> there are Avery and two sigils. These are a little different, though. Yeah. They got those star patterns on them. They turn. But which way are they supposed to go? Whoa. Okay. Should we go look? Yeah, just a second. More pirate symbols. Adam Baldridge, Anne Bonnie, and uh, Christopher Condent. I mean, there's, there's too many permutations. I say we see where that door leads. Still hoping for some treasure here. Hey, look, I was right. Baldridge, Bonnie, and Condent. Splendid. But why are they here in the first place? Well, let's find out. Well, oh, that mustache. It's almost as impressive as yours. Yeah, it's all right. Hey, look at these stars. They're just like the ones on the Avery and Two sigils in the other room. Yeah, you're right. Ah, uh, that's right. Content went by Billy. Here's another one of those star patterns. Yeah, but this one's different than that first one. Oh, yeah. Good catch. Thank you. See, I'm not just a pretty face. Huh. Bonnie was a redhead. Yeah. What do you think? Those Avery and Two sigils. The stars on those lined up, remember? Bet these line up too. Hmm. Are, uh... You don't know, do you? Hey, there were a lot of pirates out there, you know? So we're stuck. No, we're not stuck. Would you... Give me your phone. What, you're gonna phone a friend? Close. Text a brother. There. You know, these are actually some nice paintings. If we don't find the treasure, maybe we could sell them to a museum. Let's find those star patterns. Okay, just saying. Hey, Sully, give me a hand. You got it. Thanks. <sighs> Is it straight? Who the hell cares? Well, I care. God, look at Farrell's face. Looks like he'd rather be anywhere else. William Mays. American? Yeah, from Rhode Island. Just like Thomas, too. Hmm. Nah. Here we go. Hey, you still in the tower? Yeah, I just uh, climbed back down. What's with the picture you just sent? I'll fill you in later. For now, just tell me who's who. Well, the, 
The Dolphins are Richard Warren, the Triton is Joseph Farrell, and the two hands with the Pearl is William Mays. All right, great. Just stay where there's good reception. I might need your help again. But Nathan, did you find the treasure? No, not yet. But I got a mechanism to solve here. I'll let you know. Books, globe. This want guy looks like a scholar. Hey, Richard Want. He was the captain of the Dolphin. Whew. Looks like he and Baldridge were in a best wig competition. Uh -huh. There. I'm honestly shocked you don't know this stuff. Don't. I, I do. I just want to make sure Sam knows. You know, because he likes to feel useful. That's all. Aha. Uh -huh. Of course. Shit. What happened here? A uh, torch probably fell or something. Come on. Let's see what's left. I don't recognize this guy. Looks a lot younger than the other pirates. That's one. Ooh, Sam texted me back. Now, nah, see there, Sully? Turns out Sam doesn't know everything either. Gloating is unseemly. Yeah, I know. Let's just look at the paintings. Huh. No name. This guy's get-up looks Moorish. Found the stars, but who are you? Huh. Yazid al-Basra. Looks Indian. Close. Muggle. Wait, aren't the muggles the ones Avery robbed? Honor among thieves. Yeah, like that's ever the case. That's three. Edward England. Stout little fellow. And four. sure yet maybe send it to Sam really hey you're the one who said he's the pirate expert just saying okay that's one and two last one all right let's see what he makes of them you know that Kinda looks huh. like... 
What are you doing? You just took pictures. Hold that. You know, Avery's recruits wouldn't have had smartphones, obviously. Obviously. So this would have been the only way for them to get to the next clue. <laughs> These are clues. Here, let me see. Voila. <laughs> oh, all right. These could be trade winds. Yeah, and these look like latitudes. Yeah. And I would guess that we are packing our bags again, Boyle. What? Pro Deus quod licentia. Oh, no, it can't be. Can't be what? Oh, my God, it's so obvious. Nate. Why didn't I see this before? Jesus, enough of the beautiful mind shit. What the hell are you talking just, just, about? Hang on. Sam, did you get the photos? <laughs> Here I am. I'm calling what I thought was Sullivan's phone, and look who picks up. How you been, Nate? Hey, Rafe. <laughs> been a long time. How did you get this number? Sullivan leave it on a cocktail napkin? <laughs> I wish. That only would have cost me a few shots of rum, right? No, no, I had to pay top dollar to find you guys. Yeah. I hope you didn't spend too much on this whole Avery thing. I hear the competition's fierce. Yeah, you pulled off some clever moves there. But in the end, all that matters is who gets to Avery's treasure first. <laughs> well, that sounds like a bet. Hey, Nate, you know I'm always game, but my partner, well, she prefers to mitigate unnecessary risks. Wow, Rafe Adler, taking orders from somebody else. Oh, how times have changed. Look, Nate, I'm gonna make you a one-time offer here. You drop everything. Go home, live your life. And I'm willing to forgive and forget. For old time's sake. As tempting as that sounds, Rafe. I gotta say, I'm not normally the kind of guy who likes to quit while he's ahead. Okay. Rodeus quo licentia, for God and liberty. These are nice pictures, Nate. Good composition. You hacked our phones. You stole my cross. Listen, Nate. If you're half as smart as you think you are, you'll accept my offer. What's it gonna be? Listen, as nice as it's been to catch up with you, I really gotta take this call, so... Well, Nate, one more thing. Nate! What? You, uh, you do realize that your phones are equipped with GPS, right? I'll see you soon, buddy. Shit. Let me guess. Goons with guns on their way here now. Sam, for God and liberty. Nathan, do you understand what this means? Sam, listen to me. Get off the streets right now and destroy your phone. What's going on? Rafe knows where we are. Right, we gotta find some place to hide. <laughs> Sam? Sam! Damn it. Hey! Buy a new one. That's Sam's Tower. It's definitely Sam's Tower. Come on. This way. Pardon me. Excuse me. Excuse me. How long do you think before Rafe gets here? <laughs> Let's not stick around to find out. Sorry, pal. Come on, down here, Nate.
Time to bail. way he could have survived that. Right chance it. That's not good. Holy shit, he's still alive!
Yeah. <laughs> you good? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get out of here. I think the coast is clear. Yeah. All right. Pro Deus cor licentia. This looks like a simple cipher. Forgotten liberty. I mean, it's their damn motto. All the paradise references. I can't believe we missed it. See you two made it out, okay? Way better than okay. We found Libertalia. <laughs> Liber. Clipper, what are you? Libertalia. Seems Avery founded the legendary pirate colony. Uh, it's more of a pirate utopia, really. Okay, but what about the treasure? See, as the story goes, this place provided a safe haven for hundreds, maybe even thousands of pirates, and they, they shared everything. Property, resources... Money? And they kept it all in one common treasury building. Okay. So, where is this... Kami Pirate Sanctuary. Right here. That island, just northeast of King's Bay. Hey, hey, hey. Rafe has a copy of this. Yeah, well, by the time Rafe figures it out, we'll be well on our way to Libertalia. I'm telling you, that treasure is as good as ours. <laughs> Shit. How's the Malaysia job going, Nate? Seems like you're a hair off course. Elaine, it's... It's not what it looks like. Really? Because what it looks like is that you're searching for Henry Avery's buried treasure. And given the shoreline soldiers that are all over town, I'd bet you're not the only ones looking for it. All right, well, I... I guess it's kind of what it looks like. But, but I can explain. Look, it's gonna sound crazy. Try me. Well, for starters, um, this is uh, Sam. Sam Drake, my brother. I'm sorry. I, I thought he had died in a Panamanian Nate. jail. But I was obviously very wrong. He's been stuck in there for 15 years, and it's because of me. And the guy who broke him out wants a lot of money, and the only way we can pay off the debt is Avery's treasure. But, but that's the good news. We, we found it. it it's, it's on an island just off the coast. Okay, just stop. Was there... Ever a Malaysia job? I... Okay. Come, on, come on, wait. Elena, wait! I don't get you. Look, I, I wanted to tell you. You know what, enough! No, I wanted to, but how could I? I don't know, just say it. I had to protect you. That is bullshit, Nate. You just didn't have the nerve to face me again. I, I knew you would react like this. How would you react? You lied to me for weeks. If you were killed, I, I wouldn't have even known about it. And now you have a brother. Who are you? Come on. I'm me. Come on, it's me. It's different this time. I have to save him. I don't even care about the treasure. The look on your face when you walked into this room. If you're done lying to me, then you should stop lying to yourself. 
I got a plane to catch. You do what you have to do. Hey. Hey, what are you doing? Go after her. We're not done here. Well, maybe we should be. What are you saying? I'm saying maybe there's a smarter way to save Sam. Such as? Such as we give him a new identity. We... we... Put him in hiding somewhere. He's I got been contact. in prison for 15 years. He's not going into hiding. Okay, fine. You go after your wife. Sam and I will head off for Libertalia. Without me? Come on, you'll get both of you killed. Really? <laughs> Kid, I've been doing this for a hell of a long time. I think I might be able to hey, handle... Hey, you want to be helpful, Sullivan? Go keep an eye on her. Whatever you say. You need a hand? I got it. Let's go pack your bags. for a second. All this running around, surviving by the skin of our teeth. I think we've actually taken a moment to step back and appreciate just how far we've come. Huh? Sick Parvis Magna. Sick Parvis Magna. Yeah. Listen, little brother. She will get over it. I mean, we bring back a treasure like that, anyone would. I don't know. I think maybe I've uh, done this one too many times. Somehow I imagined it bigger. Yeah, well, we're definitely in the right place. We'll find us a spot to set ashore. Oh, well, I mean, at least there's an island, right? <laughs> yeah, at least there's an island. Just keep an eye out for anything man-made. Ah, you mean pirate made? <laughs> sure. So, maybe Libertalia is more of a small beachside shack. <laughs> yeah, maybe it's a treehouse. <laughs> or maybe Avery spent his entire fortune setting up this treasure hunt and ran out of money to actually build Libertalia. And let's check this out. Oh, good to me. <clears throat> Supplies from an earlier expedition. What you got there? Burns.
Holy crap, Sam, this was written by Burns' grandson. Well, it makes sense. The cross in Panama was hollow. Must be following the same clues as us. Come on, shipping out. Yeah. How come? Nathan, up there. Well, that definitely qualifies as man-made. Uh-uh. Pirate-made. <laughs> Let's find a way up to that tower. Yeah. Take an old lookout tower. Well, let's see if we can spot something from up there. Okay, up we go. <laughs> Sam, this way. Promising. Huh. Some kind of symbol. Looks like a compass arrow. <laughs> How did you know to do that? Well, there's one thing I've learned from you. Press everything. <laughs> Down there, the same symbol. Another arrow. Let's go find out where it's pointing, huh? <laughs> Come on, boat's right below us. Yep. Why don't you use the rope and rappel down? Follow these arrows, see where they go. Hey, look, another arrow over there. Hey, check it out. A dolphin. Yeah, you've seen dolphins before, right? Yeah, I have, but many, many, many years ago. I'm happy to know they haven't changed much.
go. You got it, man. This is pretty cool. What? Climbing this cliff? Yes! Climbing this cliff on a giant secret pirate island? I mean, come on. Just a little higher. We can swing off that branch. in business. Okay, hold on. I just gotta not fall to my death over here. Wow, Avery wasn't much for subtlety or understatement, was he? Well, he had the money. You got it, flown it, right? Come on, let's get a closer look. entrance is blocked by debris. Again. Well, I guess Avery's builders clearly didn't take hundreds of years of erosion into account. Clearly. I need to find another way around. Hey, Sam. Come on. Give me a hand with this. Yeah, sure. Go. Okay, come on through. Thank you. Yeah, sure thing. Nice. Well, lots of lifting and crawling under things, huh? Yeah, the glamorous life of a treasure hunter. What do you suppose this place was? Well, these arches remind me of the St. Dismas Cathedral, but uh, I don't know. Come on. See what you can find up there. You got it. Well, there's a path. But I don't see another way up yet. So, hold on. Sam! You okay? At least I'm on the other side. Okay. Uh, still need to get you up here. Hang tight. Sam! Anything? Sam, hey! You still there? God damn it. Let's see here. You're already up here? Where were you? I was finding a way to get you up here. All right. Just jump across then. Thanks. Everything all right? Yeah, everything's fine. Let's keep going. Okay. Dad, we don't need that. You're already up here. Just keep going. Hear me? When? Back there. I called out to you. I didn't hear you. Why were you worried? I was worried you got distracted. <laughs> I'm distracted now. What's that supposed to mean? Nothing. Shall we? Yeah. Let's. Anything? 
Hang on a sec. <laughs> Sam! No good, it's a dead end. Oh, All right, we'll head on back then. There's a path down here. Great, right behind you. Not this way. Nice job. Sam, in here. Got it. All right, looks like we're still on the right track. drop. How the hell did no one find this? Back at the orphanage. Did you ever think we'd be doing crazy shit like this? No, I can't say I did. the second biggest cistern I've ever seen. Wait, wait, where was the biggest? I'll tell you later. Come on, let's get down there. <laughs> Sam, come around this way. Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> All right. You doing okay? Piece of cake! Wow, what is all this? Lots of supplies in here. Tools, seeds. Uh, provisions probably past their sell-by date. Blue prints. Well, brown prints. Sam, check it out. Look, pirate captain's sigils, all gathered around Avery. Avery and two holding court over their captains. Looks like they're writing their code of conduct. Pirate Bill of Rights. Avery's ship. 
The fancy. Yeah, attacking the guns away. That's how it all started. Nathan, this is this is the story of the founding of Libertalia. Sam, look. Hey. Uh, maybe they were planning a massive theme park? Pirate land. <laughs> Sam, check out this diorama. Uh, that looks like a city street. I think they actually built all this stuff. With these guys, I don't know anymore. It's really well made. So what the hell was this place? Staging ground of some kind. Oh my god, it's where they planned Libertalia. Question still stands, did they actually go through with it? I, I mean, they must have. Look at all this. You, you don't commit your entire life to something just to walk away from it at the end. Yeah, well, things don't always go as planned. We're getting in there. Let's just lift it together, all right? Okay. Let's do this. Oh, come on, this is heavy. Just think about all that treasure. Yeah, mostly just thinking about my back. <sighs> Shit. Whoa. Looks like we got ourselves another trial. That sure looks like it. Let's see what these do. Okay, so impressive engineering. Ah, huh, they turned the symbols. That'll help. this Al Basra character? Uh, he was a Mongol. He was soldiers on the He's doing teaming up with Avery. Stories have it he was taken to be executed. He got freed during the battle and blew up the Gunsway's gunpowder cache. Oh. Well, grateful Avery brought him along? Exactly. What about that other guy? Heard he started as a nobody? Here's some sort of... out of 12. Hey, look. Symbols on the ring are constantly rotating. Jeez. The Bin Malik guy. Looks Moorish. Uh, yeah, that he is. What's he doing so far from the Barbary Coast? Same as us. I'm gonna win the action. Our star pirate. Uh huh. 
looks kind of weird. Let's see. Okay, where to now? Missing Avery statue. <laughs> you know, I'm starting to get the feeling that our friend was a bit of a narcissist. You think? <laughs> yeah. Let's go see what he's got in store for us. Oh, that's uh, that's a long way down. So, Nathan, and be honest with me, how does this stack up, you know, compared to your other adventures? <laughs> Ask me again when we finish. Don't snap, don't snap, don't snap! <laughs> Didn't snap. Sweet. All right, come on down. Boat's down there. After you, Captain. Okay, island with monstrous Avery statues to the right. I'm so excited, my hand, my hands are literally shaking. Yeah, I know the feeling. It's either that or I just, you know, I need another cigarette. Maybe a little bit of both. <clears throat> Looks like he's got a spyglass, but he's not really looking for it. Maybe he wants us to look through it. As your island, eat your eye. do the honors. I insist, come on. <laughs> okay. How are you? All right, Captain. What are we looking at? There. So? Big skull-shaped island, what? Big island. <laughs> no skull. That's gotta be it. The battalion. <laughs> That's optimistic considering everything. You know, it is just us here. You're allowed to feel just a little bit of excitement over this. Well, I'll get excited when we get Alcazar's noose off your neck. Come on. <laughs> okay. I said okay. No, 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 no. Your okays are never just okay. It usually means the opposite oh. of okay. Is that our boy Rafe? Who the hell else?
my name. I gotta get off this beach. Sam! Sam, can you hear me? Let me find her, I'm sure. God damn it! Sam! Supply box. Oh, for God's sake. Of course. Everything's gone. I think it's good stuff you sent to me. Right, Sam can't lose anything else. Besides my life. I'm talking to myself, that's that's the first sign of it. Crazy. Ah. Uh, Jesus. Okay. I'm all right. I'm all right. Oh, shit. Just push through. Just push through. No, no. Come on. Damn it. Yes. I. Sick Parvis Magna. Sam. Stay put, Sam. I'm coming. 
coming to you. No, no. No, 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 no. That should hold. Let's hope. to now. Oh, hey. Seen anyone come by here? Tall, lanky, filled with big, stupid ideas about pirate treasure. Bad luck, huh?
bastards. Were you trying to climb up there? In those boots? Sure, you don't need this. Almost there. See anything. Damn it. All right, everyone. False alarm. But keep an eye out. Let's go. Runs off. You'll see. Wait. <laughs> what was it? Hey, did you hear me? Come on, man, really. Hey, come on, Zach, will you hear? What can your mama do on say? And look on. Are you trying to give away after this? I'm just trying to infuse some culture here. You look culture to yourself, of course. <laughs> 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 Hmm. 
Hmm? Shit! What was that? Nothing here. What the? Oh, where the hell did he go? Okay, where to? <clears throat> oh, what's this? Wow, that is pretty dark. Seems like Burns' crew had about as much luck as me with this treasure. Uh, uh, you can't get me. No, 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 no. Uh, 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 holy shit. Uh, Shot your head off. Sam, you're okay. Yeah, 
Nothing I can't walk away from. Hey, it's good to see you alive, little brother. Come on. We got a treasure to find. Hold up, man. I mean, <laughs> what are we doing? What do you mean? I mean, our supplies are at the bottom of the Indian Ocean. Okay, so we go steal some from Nadine's army. Yeah, and there's that. We're going up against an army. Yeah, we've been holding our own so far. While being marooned in the middle of nowhere. We were trying to get here, remember? When we had an escape plan. Just hear me out. Crazy suggestion. Let's go down there and at least secure one of Rafe's boats. The boats can wait. <laughs> You want to know what we're doing here? We are buying my life back. Okay, and we're going to do that by stepping into that jungle and finding the Britalia. Have you even seen any signs of a massive pirate colony? Because I sure the hell haven't. It's a little late to start developing doubts, don't you think? But can we at least acknowledge the chance that maybe Avery's idea for a secret pirate utopia didn't pan out? <laughs> and maybe we're just swept up in this fantasy when instead we should be looking for a real way to save you. I'm gonna scour this island inch by inch if I have to until I find that treasure. Now, if you're confused about what you're doing here, then you can go home, Nathan. Wait, 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 I can go home? Are you kidding me? Do you have any idea what I put on the line to get you here? About what I put on the line, okay? The last 15 years of my this life. This has nothing to do with that. It has everything to do with that. Holy crap. You still want to go home? Let's just see what else we can find. The rest of it isn't buried under centuries of dirt and rock. Sam, up here. I'm coming. Well, no one's home. Seen better days, huh? Yeah, the roof could use some work. <laughs> Sam, this way. <laughs> ah, yeah, that's not happening. Hey, Nathan, I think there's a way through here. This way, Nathan. <coughs> God. Rusty. Oh, all this crawling is a good workout for my quads. Oh, feels good to stretch out again. Yeah, you said it. There's a crate. I got an idea. Here we go. Heads up! All right, we're in business. You're gonna want to see this. White Street. Clearly a commercial district of some kind. Yes, thank you for that, Nathan. Come on. What do you see? You just want to hear me say it, don't you? Really want to hear you say it. All right. Libertalia. <laughs> Libertalia! 
Natalia. The long lost legendary pirate utopia discovered after 300 years by one Samuel Drake. And? and and his younger, slightly less charming brother, who happened to be tagging along for the ride. You know, I always knew you'd make something of yourself one day. Yeah, just so you know, it's not my first lost city. You should, should, should just enjoy the moment. So where you want to start? How about that building right over there? Oh, you mean the one with the massive guard tower? Yeah, I say we go see what it was guarding. Works for me. This is... I mean... I'm speechless. Holy goddamn shit, Nathan! <laughs> That's your idea of speechless? God, how long do you think it took them to build this place? Years. Decades, even. How the hell did they keep it a secret all the time? Hey, Sam, check it out. Blacksmith Forge. <clears throat> Making some cutlasses here. A vest, you dirty dog. <laughs> nice. I was doing the thing. Yeah, no, I know. I was doing the thing. Right. You're a horrible pirate. You suppose they traded with other colonies? Uh, if they did, they didn't do it on this island. Otherwise, word would have gotten out about the place. Good point. Looks like we found the local watering hole. Pirates will be pirates. <sighs> Not a bad view. Hey. Cheers. <laughs> yeah, cheers. <laughs> What are they doing here? Oh, the colonists? Yeah. I mean, you throw your lot in with these infamous outlaws, <laughs> then what? You know, take a load off, yeah. find some refuge, enjoy a little grog. <laughs> it's far worse fates. Yeah, I guess. Except you have to see Avery's statue every day. <laughs> Hey, you, uh, you ever wonder, like, with different choices, how we might have ended up? I mean, like, you taking your magic show on the road? <laughs> no, that was a, that was an option. I was good. <laughs> it was not a viable option. What, you know what? You're just jealous. Uh, you always were. <laughs> no, but I mean, what would our lives have been like if we hadn't started by chasing these people who've been dead for hundreds of years. You think it would resemble more of a normal life? Mm -hmm. Normal. You've got everybody gathered around the table for Thanksgiving, exchanging all the baby photos, something like that. No, no, thank you. Not for me. I like the hand we've been dealt. Yeah, I've heard that before. Come on, we're, we're fortunate, man. <laughs> this is fortunate. Yeah, I mean, of course, I've been locked up for the last 15 years, so it's all relative, I suppose. <laughs> all right, well, I'll give you that. This is much better than prison. <laughs> well, my mugs run dry. Yeah, I was about to say, service here is lousy.
Locked, of course. Hey, looks like there's a path or something through there. Hey, Sam, check it out. It's like a pirate code of conduct. Hmm. Thought the whole point of this place was not having rules. Well, even pirate ships had their own rules. Captain Avery, I was wondering when you'd turn up. What's this symbol? I saw a few of them when I was coming to find you. Who's marking these places? Is that another sigil? No, not that I know of. Maybe invaders? I mean, I'm sure these guys had plenty of enemies out there. That's a good point. Hey, Nathan, check it out. Oh, I would totally get a picture of myself in this thing. If we had a camera, that is. Well, hey, I can sketch in my journal. Really? Yeah. This is amazing and all, but how do you suppose we get to that big building with the tower? It's even a pirate utopia needs a place to lock up riffraff. <laughs> Can you imagine who pirates put in prison? Well, hypocritical, don't you think? Pirates having a jail? Well, I guess every group has its assholes. This way, follow me. Hey, Sam, come here. This looks promising. Right by. You. Looks like a hideout of some kind. Yeah, but who would they be hiding out from? Themselves? Look at this. Looks like the layout of the commercial district. There's our treasury right there. See, there's the tower. What were these guys up to? That's our way out of here. I see some light down below. Holy shit. Hey! Uh, 
I found more of the colony. Someone took him out. Someone's here. Start a sweep. I'm gonna find you. Hmm? No way I imagined that. Watch yourself. Oi, right, fan out. Any more? Or are we clear? Okay, we're clear. You all right? <laughs> Come on, Sam. Steady. Steady as anything else around here. Building over the edge. Hey, 
Society for the boss lady. Over there, eh? Hello? Hey, you okay? Got a man down over here! They've got to be close! <laughs> Anything interesting? Talk to me, man. That's it. For now. Better keep moving. Over here. Come on, ready? Ready. All right. Thanks. Careful, it's a long way down. Yeah, I see it. Okay. Oh, crap! Whew. Watch that first step. It's a doozy. Yeah. in the middle. We'll make do. Keep heading up. <laughs> How you doing back there? A hell of a view.
Now what? Trust me and follow my lead, okay? Something like that. <laughs> Definitely in the high rent district now. Not residential, though. I think some kind of administration building? Probably. Maybe Libertalia had a zoning committee. <laughs> Maybe they paid taxes. Who knows? Nothing up here. No way through up here either. Must have taken years and years to build. <laughs> that was great piles of money. Comes no responsibility or restraint, apparently. Ish. Yeah, well, money can't buy taste. Improvised barricades? What the hell happened here? Some kind of battle. It's a rhetorical question. The real question is who's fighting who? And why? Some of these bodies, dressed a bit more fancy, look like soldiers. So it was the colonists versus the soldiers. And if that's the treasury up there, it appears someone was trying to make a withdrawal. Yeah, let's just hope they didn't succeed. Right? Man, this is impressive. Uh, to say the least. Here we go. Or not. You wanna give me a hand? Yeah. It's empty. Of course it is. You think Rafe? No. Nothing's been touched in here for hundreds of years. Right. Well, search for clues? Yeah, search for clues. Hmm. Thief? this old manifest what's a treasure <laughs> no 
Nada. Hmm. Fancy clothes. Kind of uniform. Uh, you were a guard here, weren't you? Nice job. What the hell happened here? Good question. What if maybe there's no treasure left? You know, they spend it all on marble floors. So the colonists find out their money's gone and they get pissed. Yeah, maybe so. Another one. Man, is this what was on the shelves? Another thief. What happened here? Nothing. Hey, Nathan, over here. Hey, Nathan, check it out. What do you got? The battalion money. It says Avery Sigil on it. Mm -hmm. he must have melted down like gold, minted his own currency. So based on that, all the manifests on the shelves, the treasure was here. Yeah. Leaves the bigger question, where is it now? Okay, so we know that there was fighting outside. Yeah, Dan, inside. What do you think the colonists stole it? No. I think they were trying to reclaim what was theirs. Look, there's Avery, two. Founders of Libertalia. All marked with the word thief. Not murderer, not tyrant. Thief. So by the time the colonists busted in here, the treasure was already gone. Yeah, because these guys had already taken it for themselves. Pirates will be pirates, right? Uh, pirates will be pirates. Huh. I know where they moved it. What? Where? It's a map. Yeah, right there. That's our treasury. It's a map of Libertalia. All right, so follow it to the other side of the island. And look, right there. New Devon. Wait, Avery was from Devon, England. He sure was. Man, those are some seriously large mansions. Each of them has its own sigil, too. Because that's where they lived. You say we uh, climb that watchtower, huh? Get our bearings. New Devon, here we come. Now, how do we get up there? I got an idea. Can you give me a hand with this? Okay. Okay, ready? Okay, that's step one. Step two. Raise the chandelier. Good idea. <laughs> Just take the compliment. Excuse me. Oh, sorry, Condon. Baldridge. What? You're stepping on Baldridge. Oh, so I am. Oh, 
All right. Up we go. I'm really shocked the stairs are intact. Hey, hey, hey. Don't jinx us. Too soon. Like I said. Nathan, you seeing this tower? Sure am. Sam? Yeah? All right, just making sure you haven't plummeted to your death. <laughs> just about there. <laughs> sure is excited. Need a lift? I love a lift. Come on, ready? Ready. All right, I found something. Hey, stand back. Here you go. Oh, quite the crow's nest, huh? There it is. Just on the other side of the river. Now, what do you say we go? Rob from the rich, huh? Hey, is there a path down there? Uh, of sorts. Come on. So, how long you figure it'll take us to get the new Devon? Well, a couple hours. Depends on what or who we bump into along the way. Shit! Oh, oh, shit! Jesus! You all right? Yeah! Come on! Go to the window!
Kick his ass. Hey, Sam, kick his ass! Shit. All right, let's try this again. This clever. Uh, I have my moments. Yes. You and your brother have proven yourselves the more capable treasure hunters on the island. Shame we're not on the same side. Hey, there's, there's still time. Trust a trick. I'm not falling for that again. Hey, hey, just, just let's talk. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, that was a bit rougher than expected. I'll just, uh, see myself out. After everything, you think I'm just going to let you walk away? That'd be the wise thing to do. Oh, come on, Nadine, really? We know you're a badass and all, but there's two of us. I don't think my men are on their way here right now. All I have to do is buy some time. That's if I don't finish it myself. God damn it. Go! <laughs> I'm tired of this island. I'm tired of your brother. And I'm tired of you. Oh, I know you don't. Get <laughs> We just talk about this. I don't think so. Fast, but you're not that fast. Hey, forget about her. Come on, we gotta get out of here before they. Shit. Whoa, 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 whoa! Everybody, just, just calm down, okay? Well, this is interesting. Nate, Samuel, put your guns down, all of you. No. Rafe, this guy's on edge. Oh, don't worry about him, Nadine. These guys don't kill anyone in cold blood. It's just not their style. You wanted to bet her life on that? Go ahead, then. Shoot her. Sam. I die, you both die. So be it. Not another step! You mean... like this? Sam, put the gun down. I warned you. Do it! Rafe! It's done! Hold your fire! Don't shoot! Put it down. It's done. Okay? It's done. Don't worry, Nadine. It's not their style. I say, I didn't think he had it in him. <laughs> Samuel. You okay? I guess you knew this moment was coming, huh? Hey! <laughs> Come on, man. You already got us. Take it easy. Come on, now you're a businessman. Let's just, just work out a deal. Oh, a deal? Oh, yeah. Love to hear what you have in mind. 
Oh, you can go ahead. I'm listening. I just... I... Uh, you want to find Avery's treasure? We'll help you find it. And in exchange, I let you live? Yeah. That and a small cut. <laughs> the gauchos on this guy. Just enough to get him his freedom, okay? His freedom? Nathan. Yeah. He did hard time. Our time. And the guy who broke him out, Hector Alcazar, he owes him a lot of money. Whoa. What the hell are you talking about, Nate? Hector Alcazar died in a shootout in Argentina like six months ago. I'm the one that got Samuel out. Oh. Wow. What did he tell you? Sam, what kind of story did you cook up? Alcazar? Really? You lied? You lied to your baby brother? We're wasting time! Just a second. Thing is, Nate, I never stopped looking for Avery's treasure. I just kept running into these dead ends. <laughs> and then I hear that our dear old Samuel Drake, an authority on Avery, is alive and somewhat well. There was no breakout. I bribed the prison warden, and your brother, he just waltzed right out the front gate. He spent the last two years tracking down the second St. Dismas Cross. You know what? He did it all with me. Uh, oh, yeah? No, that's bullshit. Oh. Sam, care to refute? Nate. Oh, Sam. Jesus, no. No. Listen, Avery's treasure was ours. It was always ours. I left my light for you. Hey, look, look, Nate, if it's any consolation, he duped me too. He pulled a Houdini on me, he brought you and that old man back into the mix. And I cannot lie, Sam, that really pissed me off. But, <clears throat> all behind us now. You don't deserve it. You do? Last I checked, we're all a bunch of thieves digging around where we shouldn't. Rafe? What? One way or another, end it, or I will. Well, you heard the lady. Hey, you missed one clue, and you can kiss that treasure goodbye. You said it yourself, keep running into dead ends. Why don't you face it, Rafe? You need us. No, you're right. half right I just need Sam wait now you're making a mistake don't, you don't, don't listen ah! 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 here anyway. I don't know, no idea. But this is definitely the address. Been scoping the place out for the past few days. No one's home. <sighs> and here we are. Whoa. This place is humongous. <laughs> Where do we even start? Yeah, well, we start by finding a way in. And then we can take it the grand tour. You think this place has an alarm? Let's try and find a way in that doesn't involve breaking a window. I'm pretty sure the front door will be locked. See? What I tell you? Mm, it was worth a try. back, huh?
Hey, Nathan, look. It's an open window. Oh, yeah. Here, follow me. Come on, Nathan. Whoa. <laughs> Spooky. Oh, well, here. I brought a spare. So, are we looking for any particular room? And just keep an eye out for any books, journals, any kind of research papers, you know? It's not going to be in this attic. The boxes are filled with old traveling and camping equipment. It's not going to be in this attic. Boxes are filled with old traveling and camping equipment. Huh. Yeah, that'll do. Down we go. So, how do we find them? What, Mom's notebooks? I mean, don't you remember? She always used that off-white leather binding. Yeah, I know, but... It's such a large place. It's like finding a needle in a haystack. Here we go. White leather. Sam, I think I found one. For real? No. It's not one of Mom's. You got the right idea, though. Let's keep looking. Hey, Sam. Call me crazy, but this looks like a Ming Dynasty vase. Nathan, who in their right mind would have a Ming Dynasty vase just sitting around like that? Yeah. It's probably a knockoff of some kind. Yeah, of course it is, right? Right. <gasps> oh, we'll budge. Here. Let's do it together. You ready? Push! 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 What the hell? It's some sort of sarcophagus. Yeah. Look around. This whole place is filled with sarcophaguses. Or sarcophagi. Man, this is real. What is this place? Well, let's go find out. <laughs> huh. 
This one's Roman. Third, maybe fourth century. Here's another one. <sighs> nope. Mesopotamian washer dryer combo. <laughs> ah, I was the funny one. Always was. Hey, Nathan, check me out. Now, who am I? Huh? Dr. Livingston, come on! <laughs> Nice. Man, what I wouldn't give to get an invite like this. going huh well if you could go anywhere in the world where would you pick anywhere anywhere okay well here we go India yeah we'll visit the Taj Mahal round and round she goes Soviet Union let's go to Moscow Hey, I might be a tad difficult to get in. I always wanted to see the Red Square, though. Let's try again. England. Sure would be cool to see Windsor Castle. Right, Sam? Hey, hey, don't look at me. It's not my fault you weren't born yet. It's not like I remember much of it anyways. And it wasn't that cool. Uh-huh. Okay. One last spin. Brazil. Hey, now you're talking. All kinds of undiscovered places in the rainforest. And all kinds of undiscovered tribes with poison darts. Yeah, that too. Hey, check it out. Utility totems. Are you a little young to be looking at that stuff? Wow. This table's as big as the ones in the orphanage dining hall. Wouldn't go as bad. <laughs> Wouldn't take much. Damn. They must have thrown some great parties in here. Judging by the artifacts, they certainly had enough money for it. Yeah. Looks like it's been a long time since the last one, though. Hey, check out this crazy demon helmet. Is that a Viking helmet? <sighs> Come on. You know Viking helmets don't have horns? It's Persian. Oh. My bad. Flintlock rifles. I wonder if they still work. of Arabia. Always wanted to see that flick. 
Never got around to it, though. Jousting armor. Looks French. A dragon gong. Huh. Looks like it's from Southeast Asia. Nice. Going it alone. Look at these. Compass, sundial. Just imagine being lost at sea. And those instruments are the only thing standing between death and salvation. Yeah, it's crazy. Can you imagine being the one to actually uncover these things? <laughs> Must be something, right? Hey, they've got your favorite book here. Really? Which one? A general history of the robberies and murders of the most notorious pirates. <gasps> yeah, more like a generally made up history. Even the author's name is a fake. Fake or not, this looks like a first edition. Are you serious? Man, this place, man, wow. <laughs> Wanna take it with you? <laughs> nah. It'll just disintegrate in my backpack. You could sell it. Then you wouldn't need to take that job. Well, tonight, let's just stick with what already belongs to us. Let's check upstairs. Since when do you like classical music? Excuse me, I am a man of many tastes. Is that a letter? What's left of it? Someone wanted to buy their stuff. Guess they said no. Not like they needed the money. I wouldn't want to part with the stuff either. Samurai. You recognize the crest? Uh, hollyhock leaves are, um, let's see, don't tell me, don't tell me, uh, Tokugawa clan. Yeah, right you are. Damn it. Journals about everything in the world, but nothing from Mom. It's a big house. Don't give up yet. Oh, wow. They knew Amelia Earhart? No kidding. Man, they knew all the cool people.
Hmm. It's locked. Mom's stuff might be in one of these rooms. We gotta find another way in. Hey, the air vent, up there. Oh yeah, that could get us into the room below it. Not us, you. What? I, I can't fit in there. Can you handle it? You kidding me? Can I handle it? All right, let's see what you got then. Here, check this out. Are you ready? Oh, oops. It's a Polaroid. Let me see. I think it still works. Come here. A smile, all right? Don't lose it. Okay, up here. Hey, don't fall. Okay. It's a good thing I'm not claustrophobic. All right. Okay. I'm in. Can you get the door open? Uh, hold on. <sighs> Coding. Lots of painkillers. <sighs> it's locked from this side, too. Hey, look around. Is there a key nearby? Well, that's sad. Got it.
Anything? <sighs> Didn't see any journals. All right, well, we still got the other locked door, so come on. something <laughs> this is it seen this one. Yeah, me either. But that, you know, that's definitely Mom's handwriting. Put up your hands. Slowly. Hey, hey, hey. There's no need for that. What is he holding? Hey, hey, you keep your gun on me. Give me my journal. <laughs> all right, all right. All right. I'm sorry, Nathan. So what now? Now, we wait uh, for the police. Yeah, you don't want to have to deal with that headache. Stop. I mean, the hassle of ruining two kids' lives, that's... I really don't want to shoot you. Come on, lady, it was no harm, no foul, all right? We all must face the consequences for our actions. And at least let him go. I brought him down here so he could see our mom's stuff. That's it. He had nothing to do with this. What? I'm telling you that this is all on me. No. Your mother's stuff. Yeah, that, that journal. It was our mom's. You're Cassandra Morgan's boys. Uh, hi? My God. <coughs> I could have shot you. Yeah, you still might, so, uh, do you mind? You knew her mom? She worked for me. As I'm sure you've noticed, I'm a collector of sorts. <laughs> That's sort of an understatement. So, Mom was like your translator? Your mother was the most brilliant historian I have ever met. <laughs> mm. 
We could have accomplished so much together. But then her illness and... I'm sorry. No, it's all right. Happened a long time ago. Of all her discoveries, this would have been her crowning achievement. Sick Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Sir Francis Drake's motto. Yeah, Latin and historical figures. <laughs> Those were our dinner conversations. We were uh, a weird family. Did she ever tell you her theories regarding Sir Francis Drake and his heirs? Uh, Sir Francis Drake didn't have any heirs. Yeah. That's what history tells us. But your mother and I believed otherwise. Learning that old pirate secrets is just one more adventure I have to let go. I guess there's a lot I have to let go. <laughs> Forgive me. Ramblings of an old woman. Here. It is as much yours as it is mine. Who knows? Perhaps one day you'll be able to finish what she started. Uh, yeah, so, uh, we're off the hook, right? I'll handle the police. You found your way in. I trust you can see yourself out, hmm? Yeah. Uh, Here. <sighs> Thank you. Sorry about the mess. <laughs> All right, come on, Nathan. Let's go. <gasps> Are you okay? Oh, holy shit. Hey. 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 Sam? The police. You all right? Wait, we have to do something. Yeah, we need to get the hell out of here. You can't just leave her here. There's nothing we can do for her. All right, we have to run. If the cops find us here, then this. Ma'am? Nathan! We gotta go. Right now. Front gate looks clear. Front gate. Got it. Okay. Hey, Dave! You all right? You there! Don't move! Run for it! This way! We can lose him! Freeze, goddammit! This way! Go, go, go! <laughs> Run like hell, Nathan! You're only making this worse for yourself! Come on, go! I did already! One more warning! Down on the ground, hands on your head! Gotcha! Oh, shit. Come on! Run! Oh, God damn it! Nathan! 
Nathan, over here! There! By the guest house! Run! Oh shit! They're both dead! The dumpster! Come on! Okay. <laughs> Hold on tight. I'd say we're clear. But we catch our breath for a second. Some night, huh? Some night. That old lady. Hey. Hey, you listen to me. That wasn't our fault back there. I mean, that lady, she... She was, um... Sick. I mean, it's okay to feel bad. But there was nothing we could do about it. So what are we gonna do now? I can't go back to the orphanage. You can't go back to your job. Then we don't. Sure. No, I'm serious. We get as far away from this place as we possibly can. Yeah? And how long till the cops find us? Oh, I think they'll be looking for Nathan and Samuel Morgan. Yeah, that's us. What if it wasn't? Nathan? Back at that mansion, you knew just as much about that stuff as that poor old lady. Here. I always felt that we were destined for something great. But until tonight, I didn't know what that meant. But this... Mom's unfinished work. This is our chance to restart our lives. With brand new identities. What are you talking about? I know some guys. Pretty good at forging papers, too. Now, as for our new name... Mom believed that Sir Francis Drake had heirs. Who's to say he didn't? You're serious, aren't you? Nathan, we were meant for this. And I promise, you and me together, we're gonna go far. So what do you say? Nathan Drake? And everything changed after that. You know, we became explorers, adventurers, mostly thieves. Ow. Okay, just hold still. You know, for a while it felt like you know, if we weren't taking turns going to jail, it was because we were in jail together. And you know, after I lost him, I, or after I thought I lost him. I, <clears throat> you didn't want to bring him back up again. Something like that. That's it. Now you know everything. With you, I doubt that that's everything. But... It's a lot. I'd love to know what you're thinking. I'm thinking that you're lucky that I found you when I did. I'm glad you didn't lose a limb or anything. It would have been a royal pain getting you out of here. How did you uh, find me anyway? Oh, you know, easy. Just follow the sound of gunfire. <laughs> no, I mean, how did you get here? Oh, of course.
yours. <laughs> Come in, Sully. Hey, darling. How's he doing? Oh, you know, he's banged up, but he's alive, par for the course. Now we just need to rescue the other Drake. What do you mean? I'll let Nate tell you. Hey, pal. Glad you could join us. Yeah, I wouldn't miss it. So what happened to Sam? Rafe's got him. Shit. You know where they are? Uh, yeah. They're headed to the northern side of the island. See if you can find a place to set down over there. Once we get Sam, we're gonna need to get out of here pretty quick. Copy that. Hey, hey, what about the treasure? Forget it. We don't need it. But Alcazar... No, there is no Alcazar. It's all bullshit. Wait, you mean... the death, the... The escape? Yeah, Sam made it all up. What an asshole, right? Look, I'll fill you in on everything when I see you, okay? Yeah, I can't wait. Look, you two be safe down there. You know us. JJ. Thanks. Sure? No, I mean... Thanks for saving me. Again. I almost didn't this time. Right. Come on. I got us a ride. So, we're headed to the northern side of the island? Yeah, New Devon. One of the founders of Libertalia. And that's where Wraith is taking your brother. The treasure's probably there. Just need to save Sam before they find it. Look. Up there. I borrowed it from your shoreline friends. You slid all the way down from there? Yeah, it was the quickest way to get down to you. Now we just gotta figure out another way back up. Yeah, here. Been here long? On the island? A few hours now. Did you see the colony? I did. From the air. Pretty incredible, right? I didn't get the full tour. I was a little preoccupied with finding. Right. So, did uh, Sully fill you in on the deal with this place? Yep. Henry Avery. 400 million, 12 founders, hundreds of colonists, something like that. Yeah, that just about covers it. Had some time to kill on the flight over. Is that an elevator? Sure looks like it. I swear, Avery recruited the best engineers of his time. He must have used it to move supplies upriver. Yeah, that's a fair bet. your car just need to get up there well what do you think which way well, let's take a look ah 
it's too high. Let's find another way up. There's got to be something around here. Ah, refreshing. Here we go. I can boost you up there. Great. There's a way through over there. See if you can find something I can use. Yep. Hey, I found something. Hold on. No good. Hey, nice jump. Not bad, right? Way to go, Nate. Piss a girl like that off. Idiot. Come on, I'll meet you around. <laughs> Dead end. Well, maybe the elevator still works. I doubt it. 300 years old. I've been exposed to the weather, and who knows if it Got ever works. Oh, look, it works. I'll just uh, meet you at the top, I guess. Nothing to it. Now then, which way's the car? It'll be easier to spot from higher ground. Right. Good idea. Some exercise at least, right? Look, 
shoreline. They found your car. Technically, their car. So, let's get it back. Hmm? All right then. That's it. In your reputation. Let's go before more of them show up. Hey, you see a way out? Up river. There's an opening by the falls. that elevator it's massive yeah I'm guessing new Devon's at the top then let's get up there so here's my question why does Ray Fadler want Avery's treasure it's not like he needs the money what's the glory he doesn't want to be known as a guy who only got rich because of his inheritance walking away isn't an option for him well, Rafe is a good match for Shoreline. He needs their muscle and they need his money. They do? They seem pretty well stocked. Shoreline got involved in a couple of civil wars that didn't pan out for them. Nadine inherited her father's mess. She's probably hoping that this will put her back on the map. So good. He's heading upstream. Bet you could write a killer article about all this. <laughs> I could. I doubt anybody would believe it. 
Oh, you can take pictures, too. I didn't bring my camera. Kinda wish I did, though. So, why do you think Sam would come straight to you after Rafe got him out of prison? I think he wanted to gather every clue that Rafe had on Avery before bailing on him. Plus, he needed time to come up with that crazy Alcazar story. I mean, if I had just looked it up. That is one crazy contraption. It looks big enough to fit the car. Well, here's hoping this one works as well. Let's look around. Of course not. Would have been too easy. The water wheel's still working. Well, either we fix this thing or we find a way to climb it. Let's see what's what. Well, that's a problem. Gears aren't connected to the water wheel. You think it's fixable? We'll need to get up there and see. Didn't do anything. Stop the water wheel. Didn't really help us though. All right, let's try something else. I can get up there now. Thank you. Yet. I'm gonna climb higher. Need an elevator just to fix the elevator. I'm gonna detach the winch now. Okay!
Good call. Here we go. to uh... oh never mind okay hey watch out stay down use the car as cover let me see if I can flank them You sure? You seem to be doing fine. After all that, I need a break. Oh, definitely earned it. So I was thinking, all this engineering and architecture, it doesn't come cheap. Do you think there's even any treasure left? We are wondering that ourselves. There's the elevator. There goes nothing.
Whoa, hang on. Ah, there. I got control again. We're getting there. You didn't happen to bring us some spare clothes, did you? I did. Great. They're on the plane. Not great. That damn. We can drive through the sluice gate. go. It's no good. It's blocked. Okay. I'll try the other one. Number two. Looks like this one's clear. Nice work. We're good. Close, fish. We need to get more speed. Watch this. Hang on. We did it. Sound surprised? Maybe a little. And we're up. Pretty odd that elevator's working. Uh, so far, we're two for two. Yeah, which means we're due for some disaster. Well, the water wheel's working. That bodes well. Come on. Probably the elevator, the elevator keeper person. The elevator keeper person. Yeah, you know, how else are you gonna pass pirate safety inspections? Okay. Hmm. Guess these guys knew something big was going down.
get the car. Oh, that's heavy. Okay. Here goes nothing. Give me a hand with this. Right. Okay. You know, even if you think that you're protecting me, you don't have a right to shoot me out like that. No matter what it is, you're supposed to come to me so that we can work through it together as a team. I know that. Really, I do. It's just... I... I, I... You know, it... We should stay focused. There'll be time for this later. <sighs> Next stop, New Devon. Sully. Where are you? Still in the air. Now a bunch of shoreline vehicles heading north. I guess we'll see them soon. You two doing okay so far? We hit a few hitches, but so far so good. All right, good. Keep in touch, will you? I'm not the no news is good news type. We'll try. Over and out. Okay, be on the other side of the bridge. Hang on tight. Nate? Hold on! What? Oh, I hate bridges! Ah! Oh, oh, Turn around, we're heading for the falls. I can't! Current's too strong. Nate! There! We can climb up those rocks. On it! Go! Go! I got it! Come on! Hey! Uh, waterfall! Waterfall! Hey! Okay! I'm okay! The tree! The tree is not okay! Oh, come on! Over here, quick! Huh? So 
much for the car. I wasn't trying to protect you. It's just, I, I made a promise that I was done with this life. We both did. Yeah, but I broke it. I didn't tell you because I was afraid. Afraid of what? Of losing you. I guess I was uh, protecting myself. You know? We have a lot of ground to cover. Yeah. Just keep moving. Yeah. This way. We're on the right side of the river now. Yeah. That would have been bad. <laughs> Avery sure picked a gorgeous island. Well, maybe we can come back here on a vacation, huh? Yeah, maybe. By your lonesome? Rest in peace, my pirate friend. Sign. Traitor. It's one of the rebels. That's a bad way to die. Here's another one. Sorry, buddy. No disrespect. More gibbets. That's one way to quash a rebellion. I have to wonder if this was always the plan. What, to slaughter all the colonists? No, to lure them here in hopes of finding a utopia. 
only to rob them of everything that they have. Well, we are dealing with a bunch of pirates. Well, that is pretty diabolical, even for pirates. Need your help for a sec. Those things don't look steady. They're not. Be careful. Excuse me. Welcome to Avery's neighborhood. It's a nice place. <laughs> if you don't mind some structural problems and some water damage. Yeah, clearly some drainage issues. A real fixer-upper opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... Looks like somebody blew that dam and then flooded the whole place. You know, I forgot. Pretty good at this. All right, so which one of these do you think is Avery's? Uh, my money's on that one. The one that's still intact. Ah. They're not so bad at this either. Yeah, well, you know, I had a little practice. I read a few books. Shit, no. shit. What? What? The front door. Sam. He's still alive. Yeah, for now. Come on. All right, keep your eyes open for shoreline types. Yep. Here goes nothing. Whoops! You all right? You know, when Sully told me about this place, I was picturing wooden shacks and simple homes at most. Yeah. Through here, watch your head. Ooh, someone had it in for this guy. Oh, another old note. Dragon. We're in Christopher Condon's house. <sighs> Shit. Shoreline. Elena, get down. I see them.
this for one man? After everything, you're really asking me that? No sign of him. Anything? Same. Nothing. Come on. Let's push him into the open. Be careful. Yeah. 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 They're here! Oh, boy. 
Jesus, I think that's it. You okay? Yeah. Let's push on. Might be a way through this cave. Yeah, it's worth a look. people did you bring here, Nadine? She does have an entire army. You think they found the treasure? Well, let's hope not. For Sam's sake. Look, something here. It's addressed to Richard Watt. Signed Adam Baldrige. They were both founders?
after you. Oh, how sweet. You want me to be your decoy? No. I was being gentlemanly there. I'm <laughs> just busting your chops. Yeah, well, the chops are plenty busted already. Thank you. Okay? Yeah. I'm fine. You? Well, wet again. Tired, bruised. Oh, hungry. Oh. I could eat. Other than that, fine. <laughs> yeah. Whew. Okay, come on. Let's keep going. Come on, let's try cutting through this house. Yeah, I'm right behind you. Well, they definitely had the motivation. But uh, you don't think it's them? Just find it odd that all these houses are underwater except for one. Avery's. Exactly. Look at this. This is from the gun's way. Oh, what's this? Jesus. Got all Lord of the Flies in here. No kidding. It's beautiful. Hey, check it out. These cannons look like they were retrofitted. Yeah, improvised defenses. Guess they didn't expect they'd be fighting each other. Guess not. <clears throat> Ooh, nice water feature. Time for another swim, I guess. Whoa, whoa! Stronger than it looks. Hold up. I'll weigh it down for you. Great. Oh, 
Okay. You're welcome. Thank you. Make a great counterweight. Uh, I mean... It's okay. I'll choose to take that as a compliment. As well you should. <coughs> Swallow some water. I made it. I'll find a way up for you. Ugh, too hard. Can't do this alone. Okay. This should work. All right, stand clear. Great. Let's move this out of the way. Yep. Thomas II's sigil. So we're in his mansion. Second in command. Going up the pirate hierarchy. Looks like we found the party. Looks like we're a little late. <laughs> hey, Nate. Check it out. It's another sigil. Oh my god. What? It's them. Elena, these are the pirate captains that founded Libertalia. What the hell happened here? Well, I'm no forensics expert, but I would say... Bad drinks? Apparently. So what was this? Some kind of wealthy pirate suicide cult? <laughs> yeah, not likely. Not these guys. On behalf of Lord Avery, I invite you to my manor at sundown tomorrow. The time has come to abandon our animosities and reunite under the banner of God and Liberty. Signed, Thomas II. What do you bet? Thomas II, Henry Avery. Looks like our hosts didn't stick around to clean up their mess. Well, that wasn't very gracious of them. Okay, so... So these guys sparked a full-scale revolt when they claimed the treasure for themselves. Now, they took care of the colonists, but then they had to deal with each other. And I'm guessing things got pretty messy. So, Avery and Two invite them up here to, um... Uh, was it, uh... Abandon our animosities. Abandon the animosities. Avery makes a grand toast. For God and liberty! Arg, ahoy, mateys, all that. <laughs> and they all take a swig. Except these two. And just like that, all the treasure of Libertalia becomes the sole possession of two men. These are some of history's greatest pirates, and they all perished in an instant at this very table. It's incredible. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry. I, uh... 
I'm sorry. It's okay. So, since our missing hosts aren't here at Two's Manor... We should head over to Avery's. Yeah. Let's go. There, for posterity. Up here, slowly. Be careful. Oh, oh. I'm okay. I got it. I'll meet you up top. That shoreline truck is still there. Yeah, I see it. Keep your eyes peeled, huh? More cannons, just like a Two's mansion. I guess the poison is mightier than the cannon. What? You know, because he ended up poisoning... Yeah, it was bad. Sorry? Yeah, pretty bad. We are officially inside Henry Avery's house. <laughs> Word of the day, ostentatious. So why didn't he kill Thomas too? Was he like his right-hand man? Yeah, that's exactly what he was. Can you imagine taking orders from a paranoid psychopath? This sounds like my first job. <laughs> what, the producer on your TV show? No, my manager from Macho Nacho. You worked at a Macho Nacho? It was a high school job. Did you wear one of those hats? The point is, my boss was a paranoid psychopath. He was the manager at a Macho Nacho. Just watch it, okay? Shoreline barricaded the front door. And left a bunch of muddy footprints behind. Let's see where they went. Hey, here we go. So, where are all the Shoreline guys? I know, right? I expected to see someone by now. Yeah, it's like they all up and vanished. You don't suppose they're pirate ghosts. Don't even joke about that. Bingo. Huh. Hmm. 
More footprints. Hello. Elena, check it out. Footprints go through this door. <clears throat> Crap, it's blocked from the other side. Why bother barricading their path unless... They found something. All right, help me push this open. Yeah. Just waiting to ambush us. Yeah. All right, let's get that door open. See what they didn't want us to find. Okay, here we go. Ready? Oh, hello there. What is it? It's a letter. Signed by Avery. Really? Read it. My loyal subjects, as the sun sets on our glorious paradise, we must endeavor to preserve its riches. The traitorous, too, knows our secrets, so we must act quickly, destroy the dam, cleanse New Devon. Here we go. Uh-huh. 
and move my treasure through the passage to my ship. Two and Avery turned on each other. Are you really surprised? I guess not. Here you go. Thanks. Let's go find that passage. There's no more footprints. They end here. Okay, so where did they go? Pirate ghosts. <laughs> Let's look around. This is amazing. What? What have you got there? It's a copy of the British proclamation to apprehend Avery. Seems like he was proud of being the most wanted man in the world. Sam's lighter. Did he drop it? Yeah, on purpose. Whatever it is we're looking for has to be somewhere around here. There's got to be another way out of this room. Maybe that passage Avery mentioned in the letter. But where's the switch? Nate. Yeah. Did you find something? I think so. How did you do that? There's a bloody fingerprint right here where Libertalia should be, and I pushed it. Nicely done. So the letter said that Avery was moving his treasure to the ship. Yeah. Do you think the treasure's still on the island? I think, uh, I think it doesn't matter anymore. Here we go. Watch your head. Yeah. <sighs> oh. Looks like Avery built himself a panic cave. <laughs> yeah, I wonder where this goes. <sighs> Guess we're gonna find out. This place doesn't look very stable. Haven. Look, fresh footprints. They must have come this way. That's a lot of footprints. Let's take this slow. Crap. Okay. What the hell was that? My money's on Nadine's men. They'll use any excuse to use dynamite. It'd have to be pretty dumb to use it in here. Yeah, they're pretty dumb. <clears throat> whoa, whoa, hold up. So, some kind of death trap? Uh, yeah. But Sam and the others somehow made it across. We just gotta follow their lead. Ugh. Wouldn't be so bad if it didn't creak so much. Just don't go where the footsteps aren't. <laughs> what? I'm just a little preoccupied with not blowing up right now. And unclench. Whew.
Lena, look. Footprints stop here. They must have made it through and it collapsed behind them. Hey, just gonna move this out of the way here. Yeah. Damn it. I have to find another way. Oh no, just hold on a little longer. Crap. Come on. Damn it. Hey, you still have Sam's lighter? Yes. Good idea. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Of course he used it all up. Smoked like a goddamn chimney on the boat right over. Relax. I brought some matches. You did? Of course. There we go. Oh, sorry. Just one sec. Hello? Over here. Ow. Ow, that's my head. Over here. <clears throat> Thanks. Glad you came prepared. Somebody had to. Come on, let's find a way forward. Nice romantic lighting, huh? You have a funny idea of romantic. <laughs> yes, I do. Nate! Hey, it's this way! Hey, this looks promising. Boost you up? Yeah. Come on. Huh? <clears throat> okay, uh, here we go. Watch your head. Yeah. Careful. <clears throat> Whoa. What the hell is this? This is creepy. The hands that stole from me. Wow, Avery's not even pretending to be sane at this point. I don't like this place. Me either. Let's get out of here. Hey, look. Avery had some gibbets left over. Gibbets. What? It's pronounced gibbets. Are you sure? Yeah. Well, no one likes to know it all. Gibbets. Wait, is that? Okay? I think so. What was that? Trap. Avery really didn't want any trespassers down here. Alright, watch your step. Me? You're the one that stepped on it. Fine. Oh, hell. God damn it! Are you okay? Uh, so far, so good. Maybe I just stay a little ways back. Yeah. Yeah. Well, now we know what caused the explosion we heard earlier. And no wonder so many parts of this passage have caved in. Hey, Nate. I found a shortcut. How do you know it's a shortcut? I'm trying to be optimistic here. decorated this chamber, too. More human mobiles. Shit. Damn it! 
Are you all right? <coughs> yeah, but <coughs> can't go that way now. Damn it, more mummies. Don't explode, okay? What did I just say? Can't be healthy to breathe. <coughs> hey, are you okay? Fine. I'm fine. I wish I'd brought earplugs. Am I yelling? Well, we're back on the trail. The footprints go this way. I'd be ready for a fight. Oh, I always am. Okay, is that a, in reference to me? No, would you calm down? You calm down. These guys weren't paying attention. There's no sign of Sam. Oh, hell. Elena, get down! I appreciate Avery's exploding mummies. <coughs> the mouths that spoke ill of me. I'd hate to see this guy's Christmas tree. I don't see any footprints. We must be on a different route than the other. All right, let's see if we can catch up. Hey. So I guess this loops around? I guess so. Jesus. This was one of Avery's guys. Dead men tell no tales.
Looks like a fight broke out. Yeah, two's men versus Avery's. Excuse me. <sighs> Hello. Some kind of key. What's that note? Oh, right. Uh, it's from two to his men. Hey, we can use the key to get out of here. That's good. Hmm. There's some symbols on the back. Well, let's go find a keyhole. Explode now? Huh? No? How about you? This guy had some serious trust issues. Whoa. Oh god, oh god, oh god! <coughs> you done? Nice moves. <coughs> Thank you. Huh. Not quite as creepy as all the hanging bones. Still, it's a little creepy. Yeah, maybe three out of ten, though. I'd say four. Really, four? Mm -hmm. Okay, it's another death trap. Yeah, no footprints to guide us. Okay, we're off to a good start. Follow my lead, okay? Just be careful. I'm always careful. <laughs> Says the guy who set off every mummy bomb in this place. There. Made it. In your face, Avery. <laughs> That's our way out of here. Oh. Are those yeah, gotta be. We know Avery likes to make an example of his enemies. Let's, uh, tread carefully in here. Keyhole? Key. Wait, it could be a trap. We really don't have much of a choice. I have a good feeling about this one. Huh? Do it. At least we didn't get blown to bits. Oh, shit. You didn't bring a knife by any chance, did you? No. Oh, but that guy's got a sword. Here, help me swing this thing. Keep running! Right behind you! Nate! Move your ass! Let's go! 
Captain Avery. <laughs> it's just like old times, huh? Lena? Lena? Hey. Hey. Lena, come on. Lena. Uh, my hero. <laughs> oh, no, you didn't do that. No. <laughs> That's not funny. Oh. oh, you have done much worse. No. God, you gave me a goddamn heart attack. Oh, let me listen. <sighs> Sounds well, good to me. Uh, you realize we're now even for everything I've ever pulled, right? Yeah, like ever. No, not by a long shot. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, you've got mud everywhere. <laughs> Anyone ever tell you you have a funny idea, romantic? Yeah, yeah, I may have heard that somewhere before. Good talk. Good talk. That's gotta be Sam. Come on. At least the gunfire means he's still alive. For now. Is that a galleon? Yeah, sure looks like it. Graveyard. <clears throat> looks like we can get down this way. Yeah, looks safe. It's about as safe as anything on this island. Closer to them. Oh, crap. Look, that's Sam. He's surrounded. Yeah. Come on. We gotta go get him. I gotta find a way to the beach. Take down. Thank <laughs> you. 
Squeeze through here. Okay, now where did Sam go? You went this way! Huh? There's your answer. A sight for sore eyes. Yeah. How about we get off this damn beach, huh? Absolutely. Did you find my lighter?
Right up here. Can't get me up here, right? better in my head. Nice work, kid. Yeah, thanks for the assist. Come on over. I'll get you out of there. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Good to see you, kid. <laughs> right in the nick of time. Yeah, well, a little antsy waiting around to hear from you two. Oh, no, we gotta find Sam and Elena still. Hey. 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 Are you okay? Yeah. We heard those explosions, we thought. Yeah, that's all this guy. <laughs> <laughs> you saved his ass again? Naturally. How are you doing? Good. 
Good, there was some close calls, but, um... He covered me. Hey. Hey. How's that? Oh. <laughs> Bullet grazed my shoulder. Yeah. You? Cliffside grazed my face. <laughs> so how'd you lose Rafe? <laughs> hey, he led his crew right into one of Avery's traps. Smart. <laughs> hey, hey, look. About the whole Alcazar thing. Hey, just, we gotta save that for later, okay? Yeah. Which way? On the beach, other side of this town. Okay. Good, I hope all that ruckus didn't attract any attention. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry. What are we doing? What do you think we're doing? We're getting the hell off of this rock. Right, we, we, we could do that. Or we could head in that direction, which is a shortcut. Shortcut to what? To Avery's treasure. <laughs> oh, wow. I mean, Rafe's got to go all the way around, but we can hey, just... Hey, screw Rafe. Hey, Victor, with all due respect, maybe just you leave just this... You just don't know when to quit. Look, we're all here for the same reason, right? Right? We didn't come after the treasure. We came after you. And I appreciate that. I, I, I do. But we're good. A and we've got the lead for now. <laughs> we can do this. Nathan, come on. Huh? Look around. Okay? Avery scuttled every last ship on this island. You know why? Because he was hell-bent on keeping his treasure. Exactly. No matter the cost to the others around him. Because he didn't want anyone to follow him. Because he was leaving. Look at this. Okay. I found his map of the island. Okay? That's his ship, right under that mountain. That's where our treasure is. And it is exactly where Rafe is headed right now, while we stand around here and argue like idiots. What if he's already left the island, and his ship sunk somewhere out there in the middle of the ocean? Then we find out where it got sunk. Oh, boy. How long have we been chasing this thing, huh? <laughs> you and me. No offense to these guys. They don't get it. Actually, Sam, they do. They really do. Okay. Uh, trust me, they've seen this kind of obsession before. <sighs> Sam, we're not those kids anymore. We're not. And we got nothing to prove. Victor, where's that plane? Right this way. Is it far? Not very. Just through this port town. What if Shoreline set up an ambush by the plane? They didn't. And what makes you so sure? Because they're heading to the mountain. For the treasure. This way. There she is. It's a long drop. How did you get here? I hopped down a few of these walls, but I guess we'll have to find another way around. What was that? That came from the mountain. It's Avery's traps. Hey, that means they're blowing themselves up. No, it means they're on the right path. Hey, come on. Let's just stay focused, huh? I jumped down from up there, but it's too high to get back up. Yeah, maybe there's something we can put under it? <clears throat> Give me a hand, Sam. All right. Uh. 
Hey, you need a hand? No oh, thanks. We got it. Hey guys, through here. Whoa, check that thing out. It's like a sky rail or something. Think it still works? There's no controls, but I bet I could pull the platform with my rope. Getting there. I can't wait to sleep in my own bed again. So close, yet so far. I got an idea. Nathan, give me a hand. Okay. Victor, can I borrow you for a sec? Sure. All right, go ahead, Nathan. There, yeah, we'll hold it down, you jump across. You're not gonna drop me, are you? Tempting, but no. Well, maybe. <clears throat> Made it! Here we come. Okay, <clears throat> we're ready. Well, this is some impressive engineering for a bunch of pirates. This will! Hang on! You guys all right? Yeah. It's like a roller coaster. Come on up, Nathan. All right, Nathan, you climb on up. I'll grab you. Just jump, I'll catch you. Let's go. No. No, no, don't you even think about it, you hear me? I'm sorry I got you into this. All of you. Hey, all of that doesn't matter anymore, okay? Just, just jump. I gotta see this thing through, Nathan. Sam, hey, listen to me. If you do this, I'm not coming after you. You hear me? I'm sorry. Sam! Sam! He called your bluff. He's gonna get himself killed. Come on. She's, she's probably right. Of course she is. Let's go. Up here. Maybe we can head him off. I'm gonna save him, and then I'm gonna punch him. All right, let's just worry about the saving part first. What the hell is he thinking? I mean, after everything that we... Wasn't this enough? Let's just find him. Hey, we can get over that wall with this. Ugh, come on. Here, we got you. You ready? Got it. Okay. All right. 
See? This isn't gonna hold. Dang, go. No, I got it. Now, how the hell are we supposed to get up there? We don't have enough time. Nate? No, not by yourself. Look, I'll come right back, okay? Look, he is not gonna leave without a fight. Yeah, well, then I'll fight him if I have to, but either way, I'm bringing him back. Just get the plane as close to the mountain as you can, and be ready for a quick getaway. Like there's another kind? It's not fair. Doing the dishes, we take turns. Don't even think about not coming back. <laughs> I love you. Same to you, cowboy. <clears throat> Damn it. I'm sure he's a ways off by now. Just gonna head to the creepy mountain, save Sam, get the hell out of here. Yeah. Be laughing about the whole thing tomorrow. Back on the trail. The footprints end here. Come on, which way did he go? Footprints. Well, you didn't fall to your death, so. Still get a chance to kill you. this <laughs> more footprints nope in we go hey Sam
This is so much harder than it looks. my way down. Sam, uh, I doubt it. I found the driveway down. But it's painful. Way down. Done here? This is the last of them, ma'am. Good. If we are here, we can catch up with the others. Yeah. Sam just stole our goddamn boat. He's headed for Avery's ship. Come on. Let him. We're done. We're done. Most of my men are dead, Rafe. And those who aren't have already left. Can you see that? The end is literally in sight. That maniac pirate of yours has rigged this entire cave. I'm not setting foot on his ship. Nadine, if you cut and run right now, the loss of all your men, everything that we've done, is for nothing. 
We have millions in gold right here. I'd say that plus our lives is something. No wonder so many of your men abandoned you. Excuse me? We're on the verge of making history here, and you're willing to just walk off with a pittance, a fraction of what Sam's gonna get from that boat. If he can walk away from that ship alive, he can have it. Hell, I'd say he's earned it. God knows you didn't. Now look, we can stand here and insult each other all day, or we can finish what it is that we've done. Oh, we're finishing it, all right. Sorry, ma'am. Thing about mercenaries, Nadine, their loyalty, it's bought. It's not earned. Now come on. Either we can finish this thing together, or we can just end it right here. Let's go make history. And a girl. By all means. <laughs> See what you have in store for us, Captain Avery. Nate? Where is Sam? Oh, he's right there. Sam? Relax, he's alive. Well, this idiot nearly got us all killed. I'm getting him out of here. No, you're not. Rafe, you can have the treasure, all right? Just let me save my brother. <laughs> <laughs> After everything he's done? How noble of you, but no. We stay here any longer, and we're all dead. Is that what you want? It's not what I said. What do you think, Nadine? <coughs> Good to see you up and about. Be a deer and relieve Nate there of his gun. 
Hand it over. You really think you can trust him? Huh? Not your concern. Now why are you trying to instigate? Nate? Nadine and I are our partners. I don't screw over my partners. Get over there. You and your brother, though. Right from the start, you took advantage of my generosity. You tried to cut me out, and it's high time you learn. What are you doing? Now you give me your gun. <laughs> Nadine? I won't ask you again. You are being profoundly stupid right now. Look over there. Nadine, stop screwing around. Jesus! I said look! Okay, it's a couple of skeletons. So what? I don't know as much about history as you boys, but I've got a pretty good idea who those two are. Well, enlighten us. It's Avery and two. They killed each other. Good for them. What's the point? Everyone obsessed with this treasure gets what they deserve. So what, you're just leaving us here to die? Oh, I'm just leaving. Whether you die or not, I don't really care. Nadine, wait. So long, Rafe. Nadine! Nadine! You open this goddamn door right now! Rafe, she's gone! Come on, give me a hand, we'll all get out of here. Won't work. Come on, help me with Sam, and I'll help you open the door. No, I'm not going to be able to enjoy one of these coins, knowing that you and your worthless brother are still sucking here. I just, just calm down. You can practice your fencing when we get outside. Nate, just shut up. Seriously, Rafe, this is insane, even for you. You want to hear insane? Nathan Drake raced a madman and his entire army to the steps of Shambhal. Yes, Jesus. Nathan Drake found the lost city in the middle of the Rub al Kali desert. God damn it. Come on, we can get out of here together. Nathan Drake discovered the fabled El Dorado. Come on, Rafe, stop. Nathan Drake is a legend. <laughs> you know, I, I shot the man who told me that. Look, I get it, you don't like me very much. You know, for all your greatness, Nate, you have nothing. You are nothing. And I warned you to get out of my way. Sacrificed everything to find Avery, and I'm not gonna let a couple of stupid thieves, a senile con man, and a washed up journalist take that away from me! You care about that parade of losers so much, I'm going to make sure they join you. On guard, dickhead. That's the spirit. You know how to sword fight? Yeah. Sticky with the sharp end, right? Oh, this should be fun. the inevitable. My arm's getting tired.
Come on, legend. Stay in burn with the ship, you'd be my guest. You got me. You know what, Nate? Underneath all the bravado, you're just a sad little boy with delusions of grandeur. Who, by the way, can't fence for shit. So long, Nathan Drake. Nathan! Treasure Wraith. It's all yours. Holy shit. Hey, come on, let's get you out of here. It's too heavy. Strike it. Again. It's no use. Come on. Nathan. Damn it. Listen to me. Listen to me. All I ever wanted to do was find this treasure with you. Sammy, hey, sure. we did it. We did it, brother, okay? It's all right. There's going to be another way. Nathan, you got to go. There's going to be something. You got to go. This tough. There is no other way. Come on, Nathan. I got to know you made it out all right. and the whole place is about to blow up! That's it. That's it! No, you don't. Damn. It's trust me. God damn it. Let's get your head down. Oh, Nate! 
Yeah, I think so. Yeah, feel free to sell anything I left behind. <laughs> sure, I can't give you a lift home. After the last few days, I think I'd like a plane with drink service and reclining seats. Plus, uh, she and I have a lot to talk about. Yeah, you do. And no more late night phone calls about one last time. <laughs> Promise. Thanks, Sully. Take care, kid. Don't be a stranger. Next time you're in town, beers are on me. I'll hold you to that. <laughs> and then the bunny escapes anyway, and it leaves little bunny surprises all over the headmaster's bed. Hey, 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 <laughs> what are you telling her? Just about your little magic phase. Oh, I hate you. What was your stage name? Go on, tell her. Nate the Great. <laughs> it's not funny, it makes sense. In his defense, he was actually, you were pretty good. Uh-huh. <laughs> Hey, look, Sam, it has been an experience getting to meet you. But the handshake? Well... Bring it in for the real thing, sister. You take care of this gnome skull, all right? Yeah, I will. I'll join you in a sec. Yeah. I like her. God help her, she sure seems to love you. <laughs> I know, right? Listen, the offer still stands. I appreciate it, but I'm good. I know, but if you feel like you're imposing, it's, you're not. We not talked about, about it. It's not about that. It's a little bit of that, okay? Yeah. But I just kind of thought that after we found Avery's treasure, I'd be satisfied. Uh -huh. Instead, I've uh, <laughs> kind of left with this strange feeling of emptiness. Yeah. Yeah, well, you know, as thrilling as the next adventure might be, in the end, I always left with that same feeling. And sometimes you just gotta choose what you're gonna keep and uh, what you're gonna let go. Well, I guess I'm just not there yet. And besides, you know, you got a few ancient cities on me. And I can't let that slide. So. Yeah, I left a couple out there. Well, thank you. <laughs> oh, that's that's our ride. Yeah. Uh, Sam. Come far. We sure have a little brother. Come here. Listen, you don't do anything I wouldn't do, all right? Get out of here, Vemos. <laughs> What's next for you, hmm? Hmm. <laughs> well, before I got dragged into this, I was working on a business deal of sorts. Of sorts? Hmm. Dangerous? Mm hmm. With these people, yeah. It's up there. Well, I just so happen to know a certain someone recently out of prison who might be perfect for this kind of work. Ooh, I don't know. Is he trustworthy? More or less. As is Portuguese. Quando seu marido volta para casa? What's that mean? How long before your husband gets home? <laughs> That'll do. Come on. You got any more of those cigars? Don't push your luck.
<laughs> hey, good morning. Indeed it is. Indeed it is. <laughs> ah. All right, I'll bite. What's going on? Land a big contract or something? Oh, even better. I'm on the verge of selling Jameson Marine. No kidding? Yeah. Wow, that... Well, hey, I guess, I guess congratulations are in order, huh? Well, not yet, but I'm confident it'll go through. They drove a hard bargain, but in the end, I think we came to a mutually beneficial agreement. That's, that's great. Are, are you gonna stay on? No, 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 no. I think I'd like to just relax, hang with the family, go fishing every chance I get. <laughs> Good for you. <laughs> so who's the sap who's gonna buy this place? Oh, uh, you are. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, come on, seriously. Oh, yeah, seriously. <laughs> Wait, Jameson. Hey, wait, wait up, man. Hey, morning, guys. What are you doing here? Just thought I'd take, you know, one final look. Already gave your husband the keys. Okay. Perfect. Is, is this for real? Nate, all you need to know is that you'd be making a very wise investment. Do the right thing here. Call me when you're through. You got it. Hi. Hi. You're, you're buying Jameson Marine? We are buying Jameson Marine. Oh, okay. How? Why? Well, I heard this rumor about a salvage job off the coast of Malaysia, and I thought it'd be right up no, our no, alley. No, Honey, look, we barely got out of Libertalia alive. Yeah. Hey, taking an illegal job? You know what that leads to. Who said it was illegal? <laughs> Look. This came in this morning. Is this legit? Yeah. Some of my old contacts out there, they worked their magic with the Malaysian permit office. <laughs> it was great. I didn't even have to bribe anyone. Well, that's good, because I don't know how we could possibly even afford to do this. Here. Hold out your hand. What? Hold out your hand. Come on. Holy crap. Where did you get this? It was in my jacket pocket. <laughs> Along with a bunch more. A bunch? Sam. He's a sneaky <laughs> one. Yeah. Of course, most of them are gonna have to go into our venture here, along with all the new camera gear. Camera gear? Yeah. You know, I figured as we're pulling all the cargo up from the dive, we could hire, you know, a small crew. We could film the whole thing and resurrect my old show. What happened to just... Living a normal life. I think in our attempt to lead a normal life, we may have oversteered. Look, when I was on that island, I missed the adventure. I missed us. And so now we have a chance to do what we love. But from here on out, we are gonna operate on a strictly legal basis, all right? And I will be doing all of the shooting with my really expensive camera. Wow. You've really thought all this through, haven't you? More or less. But listen, just say the word and I will call the whole thing off. What? Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, I don't want to be that guy who ruins Jameson's early retirement like that. That'd be cruel. Right. <laughs> it's not going to be easy, you know. Nothing worthwhile is. 
So. What do you say, Nathan Drake? Sure, why not? Hmm. Yeah, as long as I don't have to do any paperwork. <laughs> well, I can't do it. I'm gonna have my hands full with the camera. Well, I'm gonna have my hands full with all the diamond. Okay, fine. We'll take turns. Yeah. Or I could play for it. Seriously? No, listen, I have been practicing. I'm getting good. No. My hand eye is way I better than it used to be. Really? <laughs> I cannot do that to you again. Are you afraid to blame me? I am so not. Afraid on a to scale play of you. one to ten, how scared are you to play me? Like a three. Yeah, well, jack that up to like eleven, all oh, right? Because uh, I'm coming for you. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh my. That's... Fine. You're on. <laughs> Old school. So good. I really should clean this up. Beautiful. Hmm. <laughs> Sorry, Sully. Wow, Sam looks so young. I think they abandoned us.
Well, so cool. I need to ask Mom to borrow this one again. We should totally throw a party in here. They wouldn't even know. All right. But just this one. <laughs> All right. But this is the last one for today, okay? Sam and Sully are coming to visit. <laughs> Look at these two. She goes. Ah, <sighs> perfect day. Now all we need is the rest of our boat crew. Anyone? No? Nothing? Okay. Uh, the food's all here. Hey, Vicky. Okay, girl. Where's mom and dad? All right, go find him. Go. Really? Fine, I'll find him myself. And not here either. Okay, I guess I'll just wait then. You figured it out. Whoa. Good job cleaning this up. I remember that one. Oh, this was definitely my favorite dig. <laughs> Look at you all bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. 
Oh, yeah, I was hanging out with Soli for this one. The search area narrowed down quite a bit. <laughs> so goofy. Hmm. He left his keys. He left his keys. There's no way. It's just no way. <sighs> Whoa. Oh, I knew it. What is this? Oh, nice, uh, gun holster, Dad. Kind of creepy. Kind of cool. A Spanish doubloon. But from where? This is from. Hello. Gunsway heist? Wait, did you go looking for Avery's treasure? Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Huh. What's this? What the hell? Oh shit. Crap. catch <laughs> Hey, there you are. Hey. Been looking for you. What are you doing in here? Uh, looking for you guys. Come on, we loaded up the boat. It's ready. Cool. I'll catch up with you guys in a sec. Why? Uh, I just need to, um... Uh, What's get... up, Cassie? Don't be mad. Hey, I said don't be mad. Keys. <sighs> so, what did you see? Nothing really. Well, just that photo of you two and Sully. With a bunch of Spanish-looking treasure. 
and a shotgun. This is bound to happen sometime. Maybe we should just tell her. She's not ready for it. Ready for what? All that crazy shit in there? Language. Yeah, language. Sorry. But you guys are literally keeping skeletons in your closet. Or at least a, a silver skull of some kind. You know, I don't think I'm ready for this. Yeah. Nate? It's time to have the talk. <sighs> yeah, it's totally time. Wait, which talk are we talking about here? She's just a kid. She's older than you and Sam when you started That's, all of this. That is different, and you know it. Okay, look, if you guys were into some shady stuff, it's totally cool. <laughs> but I think I'm old enough to know about it, right? Old enough? How old are you again? Ah, <laughs> funny. Mom? All right. Well, let's see. Um, for me, it started when this guy called me up with a scoop on a massive historical find. <laughs> it sounded like a complete fraud. Yeah, handsome fraud. No, I hadn't even met him yet. She knew. <laughs> she knew. So this fraud says, if you fund the trip, then I'll give you the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. And for the record... I totally delivered. Yeah, you delivered us into the hands of Indonesian pirates. No, oh, come on, you know I had nothing to do okay, with that. Okay, guys, time out. You're saying that you were attacked by pirates after you found the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. Is that right? Yeah, yeah that, pretty that's pretty much right. it, yeah. Bullshit. Language. Language. Crap. Better. All right, so keep going. You know what? The sun is up, boat's ready, wind is just right. You want to continue the story? I say we do it on the water. Come on. Well, wait, what did what Francis Drake look like? Was it gross? Actually, he wasn't in there. Yeah, just his journal with a map to El Dorado. The city of gold? Uh, that's the legend. Turns out it was just a statue, a cursed statue. No way, seriously? Yeah, seriously. But uh, well, I'll get back to that. 